Hey girl, I'm, I'm Lock Lethen in today's... Excuse me. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Mm, I hate it. I don't have time for this cryptic. <gasps> no. Uh -uh. Gubs, come get your girl. She's over here doing yoga in the quad. I'm not a fan. Not a fan. She's wearing burgundy. That's not even the right color red. She's not so cute. So cute. No. No. Look, Stu is actually providing for this island, Patty. And what are you doing? Where's my rent, Patty? Do you know how much this island costs, Patty? And you're doing yoga in the quad? You could at least, like, be charging classes and then pay me. She can't even walk. She's, like, walking into the river. She wants to leave. She wants to not be here. There is no thoughts behind those eyes. No thoughts. Just walks. Look at that. <laughs> uh, where to land? And how do I do that? I'll put it in autopilot and see what happens. Hopefully I don't crash. Why won't it just let me land? I'm so confused. Y'all, it took an embarrassing amount of time to land my ship. This is one of those times that I wish I was using items. Bianca, I know this is your yard, but can you chill out with the with the zoomies, please? Maybe I do need like a fruit tree, like one right here where the stamp is. Bianca, how do you feel about your yard? She hates it. Does she know how, how long it took me to figure out if I wanted that frickin' fruit tree right here? Okay, no, this will not stand. She came inside away from the beautiful designing that I did, fell asleep working out. Is it because I said to stop doing the zoomies around the yard? You ungrateful. Ungrateful. I gave her fruit. Potatoes! Girl has everything, and she's like, no, I'm gonna go inside, stare at a wall, work out, and fall asleep. And I do have Pikachu as well. You can barely, barely see his little face back there. So he is gigantic. Um, let me get him out the plastic though. I'm gonna try my best to put him in frame for y'all. Look how big he is. Like... I really appreciate y'all for hanging out with me today and... Rory, please go away. But thank y'all so much for watching. Rory. Ugh. All right, bye y'all. Oh my god. Hey y'all, I'm Lock Lethen in today's... Hello? Hold, please. <laughs> Ribo? Yeah. Yeah. Everyone's here, including McBeal. <laughs> Already. Already coming in with the negativity. Already. Already. <laughs> Do we have one? Stream McBeal without that. <laughs> right? <laughs>
Hello, Ribo, Bowser, Bree, McBeal, I guess. How are y'all? Happy Friday. I was going to turn on some music. In fact, I'm going to anyways. Oh, I've been running around to prepare. The negativity was for Ribo, though. This isn't fair. Re irregardless. <laughs> Regardless. Why you gotta be like that? Why? Right off the bat. I guess I should be happy that it wasn't for me, but at the same time, why? Why? Is it this? Yeah. I was like, which one holds my music? It is this one. Mm. There we go. Ah, please. I'll turn it down on my side. Hopefully that's not too loud for y'all. But hello, happy Friday. I've got a new game this evening, y'all. And in fact, I forgot to, I was just about to say, put out on Twitter that I was live. So let me... Let me do that really quickly. McBeal being banned immediately is iconic. That's his, that's what always happens. Like, are we surprised? I'm not. I'm not. Live right now. If y'all were curious as to why I'm playing a new game this evening, it is really because I just bought it on sale. I think this one was, let me double check. So I was perusing the eShops the other evening and I had, first off, I had some points that I could use from buying other games. And then I also had, um, a little bit of a, I guess, balance in my wallet as well. So I was able to get two games and basically only spent like $3 and change. So I got Flutter Away, which was, how much is it in the eShop right now? It's like, I want to say it's like $2 or no, 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 no. Flutter Away in the eShop right now is... Hello? Will you load? It is currently, oh, 16% off, so it's like $10.91. But I had like $8 in gold points credit, so I didn't have to use a lot of that. And then, what was the other game I got? Um, I already forgot. Planet Alpha was the other one. Planet Alpha was the other game. Why is this so loud? Hello? And it is also on sale for, I think, $2. Pretty sure. Yeah. Planet Alpha is like 80% off right now, y'all. And it is $1.99 USD. So I got that game and Flutter Away for like... $3 and change because I had gold points and like a couple bucks in like wallet balance. So playing Flutter Away tonight. I'm probably going to save Planet Alpha for like a, I don't know, the fall time. It kind of reminds me of the game Inside if y'all have heard of it. So I'm going to play it around like cozy season type of thing. I feel like it'd be a little bit, it's a little creepy. I played the demo of it um it's a lot of like sneaking past enemies which is similar to inside so i'm gonna save it for around spooky season for that i'll probably also play inside 
cozy season is all year is is definitely all year round um i guess i meant to say spooky season and uh i'll probably play planet alpha and like inside both of those during spooky season i've played inside almost all the way through but i never beat it so i might start it from the beginning and play it during i don't know october or something mm. and then tonight y'all I've got the spiked mango peach because it's Friday. <laughs> Spooky season is also year round. You're so right, Bowser. You're so right. You're so right. In this household, spooky season is all year round. I'm probably going to decorate for Halloween in August, like soon. We'll see for sure in September because that's my birthday and my husband's birthday month and one year I decorated early for Halloween like in September and we had like a ho an early like Halloween party for our birthday parties and uh, that was so much fun so I think I might decorate for like spooky season early because I haven't done it the past two years you're drinking Shiner Oktoberfest nice anyone else having a bevy I was gonna have a Red Bull, but I had iced coffee. And so I figured I would just have one of these instead since I don't have to work tomorrow. It does sound like fun. I might, I don't know. We'll see what the backdrop will look like come spooky season. I wanna do a little something something back here. Maybe I'll get some lights or something back here. Make it a little interesting, but we'll see. I've always, wanted to get like one of those like rolly carts it's a it's like a thing you would hang your uh, i don't know like clothes on like a clothing rack but it like rolls and instead of hanging clothes behind me it would be like a curtain with like string lights so i might do that too we'll see but yes i'm ready to get into flutter away and i didn't want to like start the game because i didn't know there'd be like an intro to the game when i started it up and i also don't know how long flutter away is but I figured it'd be a fun little Friday, chill, cozy evening. Um, in fact, I'm going to Google it. How long to beat Flutter Away? Mm, oh, wow, y'all. <laughs> it's a short game. We're probably going to finish this tonight. It says it takes about around 45 minutes to, be to beat Flutter Away. So I feel even better. For one, I got it on sale because it was only like $10 versus the $12, $13 price tag. But I had all those gold points, so I spent like 2 bucks on this game. So if y'all don't care about seeing the entire game, we're probably going to beat this game this evening. I had no idea it was that short. Wow. That's, that's wild. In Ribo time, 45 minutes is five hours. Well, it's definitely going to be longer than 45 minutes for me. Um, but it'll I'll probably finish it tonight. In fact, I'm, I'm not going to stop streaming until I finish it. I, I don't have to work tomorrow because it's the weekend. So I might as well just play Flutter Away all in one stream. It's supposed to be really cozy. It's a... Um, uh, what, what, what do they call it? An exploration game? I don't know if any of you have heard of it. I included a link to the Flutter Away uh, gaming website. If you have, any of y'all want to click on that and, and like look about the game and such, it's got like the trailer on their site and such too. Um, but I included that down there. But I did I did buy this game myself, so y'all will see my true thoughts and feelings shortly. But let's get into the game, y'all. I'm ready to get into it. Let me um let me pause the music. And we will swap over to this. Oh, where my face? There we go. There's me. Okay. Flutter away. Let me move myself a little over there. Oh yeah, it's, it's made by Runaway as well, or I don't know if they developed it or published it, but okay. Very short game, 
but it looks it looks kind of good we'll see oh y'all can't hear it there we go what does it sound like hello yawn how are you Bowser, that sounds amazing. I love Halloween decor decorations. Yes. Halloween is my favorite holiday, y'all. It is my favorite holiday through and through. I will always be a Halloween girly. It is uh, it's my favorite thing. Oh, very quickly. I meant to, I meant to show this earlier. So while the game is playing in the background, I got a little something something. And if y'all are part of or watch the Nintendo Drive, you've already seen this. But I'm going to show it here on stream here as well. I got the little derpy um, Peach from the Mario movie. She's in her gear. She's very, uh, very cross-eyed. Very... Very cross-eyed. It's quite terrifying. It's her. And this, too. And I like, like, the quality is really great. I accidentally popped one of her hands off, but it just, like, pops back into place. Because, like, she's got, like, wrist movement and, like, arm movement. She can sit. <laughs> she can, like, sit down and, like, her legs and knees bend as well. Like... And then uh, she came with the blue shell, which doesn't move or anything, but I have it sitting on my desk. And in fact, I had her sitting like on the ledge of my, I have a razor, like a, a, a monitor, raise, it raises up my monitors, not a razor, but it raises up my monitors. And so I had her like sitting on like the little ledge there, but uh, she kept falling. So I instead have her sitting like this on my Pikachu. <laughs> stuffy that is always sitting uh, underneath my second monitor here so um that's and th those interesting eyes yeah 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 <laughs> can't wait to, s to see everyone's Halloween stuffs yes fall is best season Halloween is best decorations Thanksgiving is best foods 100% Bowser yeah Nintendo cart yeah look at this oh my, oh my god <laughs> not her falling off <laughs> Sound warning. Sound warning. That is not cozy whatsoever. <laughs> but I have her sitting like that on my um on my monitor. Yeah, she dead. She's she's something. But uh my husband surprised me with her the other day. I came home to her sitting on my desk. It was in fact Tuesday that I came home to her sitting here, so I unboxed her when I got home. And uh yeah, now she's like a little just a little ornament on my desk. Along with my other things. And then I have the blue shell just kind of leaning up against my monitor as well. But yeah, that's the... <laughs> Did that fall on cross her eyes? No. Well, maybe. Maybe just a little. Just a little. <laughs> but he found her... Because uh, the only one I had before her was... Make sure I'm not going to topple over everything. Is um, the Tanuki Mario, which I also haven't shown y'all over here. I've only shown it on the Nintendo Drive, but I got him as well. And he's a pretty hefty guy. Um, same thing. He's got a lot of movement. His eyes are like the glass eyes, realistic eyes, as, as they like to um, advertise him as on the box. So, like, he can, like, move his waist, move his head. His tail fell off when I took him out of the box because I pulled on him too hard. Um, but I put them back together. They're fixable, y'all. But yeah, I've got a little, I got a little Tanuki Mario. But when I went to the store to look for the new ones, because I saw that Seth got some, um, I wanted him for sure. But I also wanted Peach because I knew she was in the like her Mario Kart gear. I didn't want her in the dress. I wanted her in her like Mario gears or her cart gear. So he was able to find her for me. I have a feeling later on he's going to fall off of where I just leaned up him over there. But yeah, let's get back into the game. But I wanted to show that to y'all because I hadn't shown it over here yet. I forgot about it. All right, flutter away. I 
I think. I'm not sure if you got them at Target or at Walmart. Her at Target or Walmart. I've only been successful at Target to find them. But they only, at the time, only had um, the Tanuki one. Little Tanuki Mario, so. Alright, let's turn this down. I'm good. Y'all let me know if the game is too loud, not loud enough. Or if I'm too loud, not loud enough. You know, you know the drill. But let's get into the game and let's figure this thing out. Let's fluff around and find out. That somehow that phrase just came to me yesterday. I was like, what can I call? <laughs> what can I call the stream tomorrow? I was like, let's fluff around and find out. Let's figure it out. Let's see how this game is. Ooh, it's got a little cursor. Okay, let's go to settings. What settings do we have here? Um, language, default, camera sensitivity, pointer. I think I'm going to turn the pointer down a bit. Make it a little slower. Oh yeah, that's better. It's a, it's a little too... Let's do 70%. I like that you can change that because at 100%, this thing's a little too fast. It's hard to control. Oh, you can go higher than that? No, that's not cozy. 70% is a good point. If I need to change the camera sensitivity later, we will do that. All right, and then it's a new game. Let's go. Fletcher away. I'm excited. We're probably gonna finish it in stream if it's really short. Best experience with sound on? Day one. Oh. Press Z arm. Oh. Oh, it's like a little journal. So it's a little walkabout exploration game, y'all. On the butterfly, use, okay. I should probably be reading these pages. Okay, let's go back. <laughs> I know it's giving me a tutorial, but I wanna read these pages. It's going too fast. Day one, misty air and beautiful sunshine streaming through the trees. Morning log, this city girl has made it to the rainforest. I'm so excited. My once in a lifetime opportunity to pursue my research has become a reality. I only have five days here, so I have to make the most of it. Look how happy she is, so happy. All right, to-do list, set up camp, photograph animal tracks waterfall and then look for wildlife look for animal friends to fill in these pages okay use the camera to take a photo of the butterfly i'm lurking while trying to finish backtrackers game oh signalis is that the backtrackers game this week is it this weekend that y'all are doing that is that this weekend obviously i did not participate <laughs> i thought i saw I don't know if it was you or somebody else playing Signalis or Sig... I don't know how you say it. <laughs> Signalis the other day. I'm pretty sure it was you, Yawn. I started it. I haven't finished yet. Next week. Oh, y'all so you still have this weekend then and then all next week. Y'all should do some, like, crunch time. Like, you should, like, stream... One of y'all should, like, stream in Discord and, like, crunch time play it. Because I'll watch y'all play it, but I, I probably won't participate. Sorry. If you talk about Flutter Away, I'll be there. <laughs> My first species, a bright blue Morpho. That's actually a good idea. Yeah, because then you, like, then other people can, like, join in. And if it's, like, I don't know what type of game Signalis is, but if it involves, like, if you're, like, struggling with it, then, yeah, okay, it needs multiple brains. Yeah, then maybe somebody can help. If it's, like, a puzzle game... Or it has, like, puzzles in it. I could maybe help. So if y'all stream it in Discord, I'll hang out with y'all. 
Jan can stream it and then I won't have to finish it. Horror survival? Oh no. Okay. If you, if one of y'all streams it and I'm there to like watch, you're probably gonna hear me like scream. You're like right at the end. Oh no. I don't know if any of y'all, it doesn't end. I don't know if any of y'all have seen me play the Tartarus Key like on my channel or I streamed it one night in the Discord, in the Carpool Discord. Um, that game makes me jump too. Uh, let's see, my first species, a bright blue Morpho. Their eye spots are meant to be scary, but the blue is so magical. Use the butterfly perch to get a closer look. Okay, let's close the journal, I guess. Hello? Okay, pick up the camera. Ooh, zoom. Oh, nice. It's not like a... It does it a little bit at a time. That's cute. And then capture. <gasps> okay, the music in this is pretty good. It's pretty good. I like it. I like it. I don't hate it. Look for your boots on the ground next to you. Use R to find them and press ZR to put them on. Look for your boots. Oh. Use L to walk around. <gasps> We've got our boots that were made for walking. Walking on the brown path helps keep the environment pristine. Okay. Okay. Oh, let me switch uh, views here. I like to keep it on the YouTube studio because the chat is a little bit more up to date. <gasps> I see a picture of someone over there that I actually watch their videos. I know who that is over there. Okay. Um, let me quickly... No, can I... Ah, settings. No. Ugh. Is the camera too quick for y'all? I feel like it is. Let me quickly fix that. Um, yes. Let me fix that really quickly. I feel like it's a little too fast. Let's do... Let's do 80%. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's way better. Way better. Okay, that makes it a little less dizzy. Yeah, and I bet that is a little bit better for y'all, too. Okay. Pick up the perch. <gasps> oh! Look at the graphics on this, y'all. This would be a good VR game, too, obviously. <gasps> Look at that! I mean, I'm sure it's better on Steam, but it's not bad for the Switch. It's not bad. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah, look at that. Use the perch to attract a butterfly and see it up close. All right, we got journal things. Journal things. Okay, we read that. Ooh, write an observation. Morphos are said to be... I am not reading that word. Chula Chakis, the native forest spirits that lead travelers astray. This one actually led me to my perch. Mm. So we're taking pictures of butterflies. Interesting. Okay. You need to find, photograph, and attract new species on the perch to fully document it. <gasps> I love this. You can just bring out the perch at any time. The camera. And then our journal. We journaling. 
Beams of light will guide you to discoveries. Be sure to look out for them. Ah, look at these beams. Okay, before we go to those beams, this... I don't know who this person is, unfortunately. I wish I knew them. Um, but this is Cozy K right here. She's actually a YouTuber. She does cozy gaming content here. She was one of the she was one of the co-hosts for the Wholesome Games this year earlier. You know, I did the live reaction on stream. She was one of the hosts. She was on the very uh, left side when I did that stream. But I didn't realize she was in the game. And then I don't know who this is, but I need to find out. Chair discovered places <laughs> to sit down and relax. Are we chilling? Oh. Look how pretty it is, y'all. Look at this. I'm gonna pan. I'm gonna pan kind of slow. Oh, can I pan a little faster? There we go. I guess you've made it if you're in game. Yeah, she's got she's got quite a bit of a following. I can't remember um. What is her... How many subs does she have? I've been following her for a while. Um, Cozy K. Oh yeah, she's got 113,000 subscribers. So yeah, I'm not, I guess I shouldn't be surprised. But I really didn't know she was in here. That's wild. I see a frog, a tree frog. Oh my gosh. Can't wait to discover that species. Can we discover like mushrooms too? Cause there's a bunch of those. This is so pretty. Ooh, I bet with headphones on this game would be so like, I think that would make this game even better with headphones. I might have to add this to my list of games that I like will randomly play that don't take super long to finish, you know? Okay, let's get up. Can I get up? There we go. And let's uh, let's set up camp. Oh. When the tent opens at night, you can sleep and progress to the next day. Okay. What's this? <gasps> Table. We set up camp. What's our next thing? Photograph animal tracks and the waterfall. We're going to look for wildlife. I'm going to approach this tree frog. Because that looks soups interesting. Look at that. Look at that tree frog. Purple Brahma bromeliad red backed poison dark frog. Look at that. It's so cute. Oh. What's this? <gasps> Our pictures! I might have to take a new picture of a butterfly because I kind of want it in here. <gasps> I love it. Ooh, okay, what do we have? Um, potential... Oh, there's two other species of butterflies we need to check on. Okay. I guess other species outside of butterflies aren't captured in here. They just have them in the front. Oh, okay. But I thought I saw... Oh, hidden. Here we go. Dart frog. Is it going to tell us something? Is he just a hidden discovery? Okay. Interesting. Would this be another hidden, do we think? Just a mushroom? Don't think so. No, just species, not uh, mushrooms. Well, that's a waste of a... of a slot. We want just species. Let me bring out this again. Can I catch another one? Yeah, come here. Ah! So cute. I also hear, like, a squirrel or something. Can 
cute. Cute. I don't hate it. Oh. That scared me. <laughs> that was scary. Okay. <laughs> Why did this hold ZR and move it? That's the waterfall. Okay, before I go over there. Orchid, big tree, pink bromelot, brome bromeliad. Oh my gosh. Yes, okay, I knew that one was in there. Oh, it does like, I like do little drawings. I love it. This is definitely going to be a game I keep in my back pocket for like a day that I don't want to play a long game and just want to chill. Specifically with headphones. I have got to experience this with headphones next time. Um, I guess we'll come across more species of butterflies. Ooh, another, uh, another flower. Does this count as something new? It does not, but that's okay. I never know how to pronounce that flower. Well, I don't know if I'm even doing it right. <laughs> I don't know if I'm doing it right, Bree. If y'all have seen any of my videos or come to any streams, you know that I cannot pronounce anything correctly. Mm. Did I ever play Pokemon Snap? Okay, so I haven't played it. We have it. We have a... I don't know if we have the physical copy of it or if it's just digital, but we do have it. Um, my youngest stepdaughter plays played it. Like she didn't finish it, but she played it. Oh my god, there's a there's a, there's a capybara in this game, y'all. We'll go approach it in a second. Um, but we bought it. I guess we technically bought it for her, but she plays it. She played it when she first got it. Um, but whenever she's over here, she can play it. But I watched her play it. But that's a good idea. I should probably play like Pokemon uh, Pokemon Snap on stream. What is this? <gasps> feathers. Hello? Toucan Feathers. Toucan Sam is here. Where are you at? Where are you at, Toucan Sam? That was new. <gasps> Ooh. <laughs> Feather equals bird. <laughs> Feather equals bird. <laughs> yeah, that's the other reason I like this game is that it has a it has a capybara or a copybara, capybara, capybara. Toucan Sam, yeah. Yo, what's up, JB? How are you? JB is awake. JB is here because I let him know. I gave him notice. Ribo. I gave you, JB, and my friend Gubs notice that I'm streaming tonight. I should, like, have a list of who do I notify when I'm live. No, 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 I knew beforehand. Y'all should have known beforehand because I put, I, I, uh, I posted on socials yesterday. Y'all had plenty of time, like 24 hours to get, to be here. <laughs> this is more chilled, though. Snap is a bit of a race against time. That's true, yeah. You have to kind of, like, play the same level and over and over to kind of get more of the uh, creatures, Pokemon. I was gonna combine creatures and critters. I don't know why. <laughs> we're going we're going straight up backtracker cereal here. <laughs> yeah, it was all over socials, every social. <laughs> don't try that, I always see you when you say you stream. <laughs> I don't know why I included you, JB. Probably because Ribo said he always misses uh, my notifications. Or doesn't have them turned on or something. I don't know what y'all do. Is, are those different feathers? Yeah, they are. Let's take a picture of these. And then I'll go approach the capybara. Capybara? Capybara? What are we saying? Capy? Oh. Ah, 
They're for owls. Those are owl feathers. I love owls. All right, let's approach. I have notice set to all, yet I get nothing. That's so strange. I have mine set to all for all of my favorites, all of my friends, obviously. It's, but I never miss them. I always get them. Oh no, don't go away. Hello. Hello. I should take a picture of him before he ran. Uh, we'll run into him again, I'm sure. Animal friendship. I saw capybara today. They are the biggest and cutest rodents in the world. I'm a little disappointed. I really startled this one. They ran off to an area that I can't quite see an easy pathway to get. Oh, look at the picture. Maybe it's best I keep my distance for now. I hope we can be friends eventually. That's so cute. Dang it, I should have taken a picture before it ran off. I'm glad I made my my webcam smaller so y'all could see the journal too. All right. Oh, uh, other new things, y'all. So I know I'm already a YouTube partner, but I got a notice today from YouTube that I actually reached, like, the original or, um, yeah, the original partner tier. So, like, I'm, a, like, an actual, like, YouTube partner now. It's not, like, that newer tier that they created. It's the actual, like, tier that they had before. I got all my watch hours. So now I'm uh, I'm more official, I guess I should say. Were those the only Yeah, these are leaves. But that happened earlier today. I got an email from them. What? <gasps> Wait. How You shake trees to find more butterflies? Awesome, the v lock making waves. Yep. <laughs> Balza, you've been putting in work on those watch hours. What? Wasn't there like a Saturday or something recently? You were like watching all my stuff. Congrats, thanks, Bree. Thanks, thanks, y'all. Yeah, I just got a notice today about it. It was uh, I was not expecting it. I will say, um, my latest. YouTube video, my island tour of Cardinal, has done like surprisingly well. I want to catch these butterflies. Ooh. Um, has done like surprisingly well. It's like over a thousand views, which is not normal for my YouTube, like for my videos. So I think that also helped too. But I know, I know, Bowser, you've been, you've been, you've been putting in the work. You've been putting in the work on the channel. Appreciate you. <laughs> I watched that tour like 10 times. Oh my gosh. No, you did not. No, you did not. 10 times. I can't even stand my own voice 10 times over. Come on. <laughs> um, oh, oh no. <laughs> More difficult words. But yeah, the, that YouTube video has been doing pretty well, so I'm kind of I'm kind of happy. It's nice to know that it's it's doing well. It's probably because it's a Animal Crossing Island tour, and those tend to do well. But this is the best one yet out of the ones that I've done out of my island tours. So I don't know. YouTube is like it. You can kind of see like where people are, how people are coming across it, and YouTube is kind of pushing it. It's kind of surprising like YouTube is recommending that video which is not normally what happens usually people like browse and like they type certain like uh, certain words and phrases to find videos but for this one like YouTube's actually like recommending it which is wild to me not surprising result of all the hard work thanks McBeal thanks McBeal yes you did oh my god <laughs> oh guaranteed I'd screw up those words yeah I'm about to screw them up right now a dido long wing. I'm not going to pronounce the official. You know, let's take a stab at it. Let's try this. Philathria dido. 
That's that's as close as I'm gonna get. <laughs> this Dido was kind enough to come down and hang out with me. Usually they stay up in the canopy. They're so speedy. They remind me of my Zoomy dog, Linda. Linda is the name of the dog. Yes, you put in all the heart, all the work. Of course, people will watch it. Thanks, Bree. A what do long wing? Yeah, I, I, I when I first saw that word, Bowser, it, it did not. It looked a little different. <laughs> But I'm going to say Dido. Sorry, I don't know what came over me. I know, McBeal, you're being so nice. What is happening? You're being kind? Wait a minute. You're being... Kind? To me? What's happening? What's happening? Maybe I do need to make an unbanned command. But maybe not. Oh my goodness. A Zoomy dog named Linda. That Zoomy dog looks very similar to my Zoomy dog, Luna. So, okay, we can move trees. Or at least shake them like you do in Animal Crossing. To make more, uh... Oh, there's some up here too. Oh... Yeah, there they go. Interesting. Okay. They wanted me to shake this initially. Is that going to do the same? I guess so. We already did it once, so it's not going to let us do it again. Um, did it say take a picture of the waterfall? Yeah, photograph. Oh, let's zoom out. That's way too close. Let's take a picture from... Oh, here, with all the butterflies in frame. Cute. I love it. Did it count, though? Oh, it did. Okay. Photograph animal tracks. Well, we saw the capybara, ca capybara go that way. It only lets us... Uh, we have to stay on the dirt path. Apparently, that's our, that's our boundary. Oh, here's some tracks back here. Are these tracks? Yeah. Those looked a little suspicious. But there's your animal tracks. All right, we did all our daytime activities. Oh. Oh, it's turning nighttime. <gasps> Light campfire. There are fireflies. Oh, this is... The crackling of the campfire? Come on. Find a night butterfly. Is this a night butterfly? Hello? Rest on my perch. Oh, I can spin it. Oh my gosh. This whole time I could have been spinning my perch so you could see it. <gasps> Look how pretty. It looks like a, a peony flower. It's so pretty. I'm going to take a screenshot of that. Oh, there we go. That's cute. I don't hate it. Okay, let's take a picture of it too. Come on, fold your wings. Fold your wings. I want to take you in folded wings mode. Hello? Hello? Oh, wait. I hit the wrong button. Whoops. Actually, you know what? Let's do a... Oh. That's not what I wanted. <laughs> I wanted a better picture than that. Come on. Maybe I go from this angle with the fire in the back. Ooh. Hold your wings. There we go. That's what I wanted. Yes. I want to replace. I want to pl replace it. I want this one. Yeah. Yeah. 
Photograph a mushroom. Ooh, that was the next thing I was gonna do. All right. Dazzling Night Fighter. Ooh. Okay, here we go. Best attempt. Poor... Poor Pyrogenes Pasilus. Poor Phyrogenes... Jeans? Jeans? I like the drawings on this. Poor Phyro Jeans Pasilus. Not every butterfly likes the daytime. These night fighters threw a party at my campsite. This butterfly would have the coolest pro wrestler name. The pattern on its body sort of looks like a tiny fighter to me. It looks like a peony um, flower to me, in my opinion. Okay, we need a picture of a mushroom. I'm going to take a picture of these because we got the cute little butterfly here. <gasps> oh, perfect. No, I'm going to keep my old photo. I just want to... Can I... Can I have just the mushroom? Oh. Not the butterfly. Come on. There we go. I just wanted a picture of the mushroom. Alright, let's look at our... Let's look at our photos here. I have way too many photos of mushrooms. Um, oh, we can keep all of them. Okay. I was concerned that some of my other ones would go away, but we have all of them. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, I'm going to delete this one. Yeah. Bye. I'm going to keep that one too. I'm going to delete this one. Bye. Sit down and relax is our next thing. Oh, that's... Pat on back. So aesthetic. I need to be better uh, with my aesthetics here. Maybe in the morning I can get a better picture of these. I like this one. I want to get a better picture of the Dido. I like... Yes. I, I approve. I wonder what other hidden discoveries we'll find. Is this why it's only 30 or 45 minutes? Because it's day and night? <gasps> What's this? Oh, it's just a perch. I'm like, oh. I'm like overstimulated here. Ooh. <laughs> I like being able to move. Okay, now that I know I can actual, that is a cute drawing that looks just like a Pokemon whose name I can't think of. Um, Butterfree? <laughs> now that I know I can do this. Let's look at this butterfly at, at all angles here. Let's get it closer up to the camera. Does my webcam cover that? Nah, we're good. Open your wings, buddy. We want to see the pretty blues. Hello? Hello? Open. I'll stay still. Hello? Why won't nature cooperate? <laughs> cooperate, nature. Dang it. No, I think it was like frost moth or something. Oh, I know which one you're talking about. Yeah, I can't remember its name, but it does have moth in its name. Why doesn't nature cooperate? Well, fine. You can, you can go back over there. You can go over there, and I'll be over here. I'm going to take an aesthetic photo of my tent while we're at nighttime here. Zoom out. Let's see. Um, I kind of want some mushrooms in the photo. I don't want the butterfly in the picture because then it'll try to change it. Let's do that. Oh, I love nighttime photos. Every game needs to have 
like being able to take like proper photos. Chia, T C H I A, which I still play every now and again on PlayStation. I haven't beaten it yet. Kind of like slowly playing it. So every now and again, if I want to play something that I can really just jump back into at any time, because it's really not hard to get back into the swing of things in that game. That game's camera options are so good. I wish other games did the same. Alright, I guess we're just gonna chill. We're sitting down, we're relaxing. Relaxing all cool. Is this flower blooming? Did that flower just bloom and all I'm doing is staring at it? Hello? It's an orchid! I love orchids! Pretty! How big of a game do you think Fae Farm is? I really don't know, Bowza. But I'm really excited about it. I am gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. Y'all are gonna know. Y'all are gonna... I'm gonna tell y'all all about it once I start playing it. But I am for sure gonna get it. Why did I take three photos of this? Hello? If you're getting it, I'm getting it. Done deal. <laughs> yeah, I'm really, I'm like concerned. I am a little concerned after after getting uh, Disney Dreamlight Valley on Switch. Even though that game is so much fun, I love that game. Um, I don't play it as often as I used to when it first came out. Look at these flowers just blooming before my eyes. I love it. I love it here. Um, even though I don't play it anymore because... I feel like I'm so far behind on that game that I'll never catch up. Did I just pull fruit from this? Hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. I have freaking fruit. So where'd it go? It's a fruit. Hello? Can I pick you up? Oh no. Oh no. It fell. Can I cook it? <laughs> Can I burn it? <laughs> I'm so focused on this fruit now. I don't want to go to sleep yet. I have fruit. Look at that fruit. I don't know what you are. But I haven't... Okay, so my concern with Fay Farm is how it's going to run on Switch. I didn't watch... Uh, so the developers of the game did a live stream. What kind of fruit is this? The developers of, a ga of the game did a live stream where they showed how it runs on Switch and on Steam. Like two individuals were playing it side by side for the stream. I did not see the stream live. But um, I watched uh, Iona, who is also a YouTuber. She's almost, she's at like 90,000 subs right now. She's almost close to 100,000. Um, I watch her Twitch live streams, but she also does YouTube. And it's usually like cozy, like top 10, top 5, like favorite games that she's excited for on Switch here on YouTube. I'm going to put her channel actually in the description because she, I, I watch her stuff in particular for her, for her opinion. And she, um, because she's, she's very honest about stuff. Like she's not just like, oh my God, this game is so fun. Like she actually like, she'll tell you if it's not a good like purchase. Like she kind of has mentioned with like Disney Dreamlight Valley, like some of the woes with uh, playing it on Switch and like why you should probably wait. And like um, with Fay Farm, she mentioned like the she watched the live stream and she said that the Steam version obviously looked way better. So I and she also had kind of kind of concerns with it because of Disney Dreamlight uh, and how much that game like crashes and it, and it crashes a lot on me too or did when I played it. 
Um, I would design an entire area, and if I didn't save frequently, um, and the game would crash, I would have to start completely over. So I had to like change my mindset when I played that game, so I hope, hope, hope with Fae Farm it isn't the same. Um, we'll see, but I am concerned. <laughs> you don't need to catch up on Disney Dreamlight, you're not behind. I know, Brie, but I feel like I am. I feel like I am. I feel like I am. I can't help it. That's just my mindset with that game. I played it a month ago for like an hour or two because I just didn't know what else to play that day. And so I was like, I'll just play this. I don't know what else to play. And so that was a game I could easily pick back up. But at the same time, I felt like I was behind. I don't know why. There's mushrooms back there too. I'm concerned for Fae Farm, but I am going to get it. I'm going to get it and I'll let you all know. Like, the true, like, is it, does it run well on Switch? And Bowser, if you are for sure getting it, we'll test out how the multiplayer works together. But let's go to sleep and go to the next day. Alright, night log. No. Oh, select your favorite photo. Oh. Oh. I mean, this is my favorite. I love that one. <gasps> you can pick your favorite photo of the day. I made it through my first day. Despite the excitement, I did feel a little homesick. I was daydreaming of how Linda would zoom around trying to catch butterflies, how my adorable partner would swoon over seeing the capybara. Romantic thoughts aside, I have to remember that this trip is for myself. I love that we got to pick our favorite photo. Uh, I love that. And we found this butterfly fruit. I still don't know what fruit that was. I love the drawings that they did in this journal. <laughs> this one kills me. I love that. And this too. Oh my goodness. I need another picture of the Dido butterflies. I love this too. I do suggest that you wait till DDV is free to play so you can get it on PC because I have both and I don't think I'll ever play it on Switch again. The only thing with that Brie for me and my, how my computer runs is I don't know if it would handle if it could run it well because I, I'll play some Steam demos like specifically just demos on my PC and I tried the mail time demo and it did the graphics of what I saw on my computer were terrible like awful awful so i don't think i trust my pc to like play like legitimately play games so maybe i'll do that if it's free to play when it comes free to play like it's supposed to come this year but i don't i don't think it's going to they just keep i don't know putting it further down the line um because it was supposed to come out like I don't know if they said when, they just said 2023, but we're, it's, we're in August now. I don't know if it's going to this year. That's what I'm doing, not going to pay for it. Yeah, that's what uh, some of my friends are waiting too, because they know I have it, and they're like, well, I'm just going to wait, and they just keep waiting, but they don't want to pay for it, because they're going to play it on Switch as well, and if it does crash, like it crashes so much when I would play it, and it is frustrating, but for me, I just loved it so much, it didn't matter. Um, I would just save consistently, and so when it did crash, uh, it, my progress would be saved, or at least the majority of it. I just kind of had to adapt to how I play that game, but I would suggest don't buy it <laughs> if you're only going to play it on Switch. If you're going to play it on Steam, like, it actually runs well on Steam, from what I heard, from what I heard. Uh, it's just the Switch players that are having issues, and... Every time they put updates out, like I think I had an update earlier tonight as well, um, they still are too far behind in a way. I think they originally said late 2023. Okay, I don't know why I thought it was early. I played a bit of DDV on Xbox since it was on Game Pass. Yeah, I, yeah, that's probably a better way to play it too. Day two. How many days is it going to be? Do we think? 
<gasps> Day two, morning log. Sunny and humid. Ugh. That's the worst. It's humid here today. Not much rain for being a rainforest. I didn't die in my sleep. Yay. <laughs> Who knew the sounds of the rainforest were the perfect lullaby? Certainly more comfy than the city sounds back home. Anyway, where did that capybara from yesterday get to? Yeah, where where did they go? I must, I must, must know. All right, day two. Oh. Ah. Not the branches falling behind him. I love that the fruit is still here. <laughs> the fruit's still here. What did it? Can I pick it up? Hello? I turned it on, but I can't pick it up. Hello? I can only turn it on and off. Okay, well. Well. Oh, we have more butterflies to find today. Photograph brome brome bromeliad, bromeliad. Clear a pathway and photograph. We get to photograph the capybara. Heck yes, animal friendship. Gah, I keep writing Cappy Barbara <laughs> instead of Cappy Bora. From now on, I'm just calling her Barbara. She won't mind. I'm pretty sure we're on a first name basis anyways. Look at that little fluff butt running away. <laughs> that little fluff butt. Oh my gosh. Cappy Barbara. I love it. Oh, the people who created this game are based out of uh, New Zealand as well. So that's kind of why they're very nature and like creature based with their games. Okay, we're supposed to find three different, I love Barbara, me too, me too. We're supposed to find different creatures or uh, different butterflies. I wish I could pick this up. The music. <laughs> she must have come up here for some fruit. I have a feeling I'm going to need to take this with me. I don't know why. <gasps> Look at that little fluff butt. Oh. Oh, 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 fluff butt. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Yeah. Fluff butt. I love it. Oh. New butterfly or... Isn't that the same one? Snuck up on this sleepy butterfly. They're such night owls. Uh, take a picture. New species. It looks the same. It looks the same as the first one we found, is it not? Is it new? Hello? Are you new? I do like it. I like butterflies that have um, their wings look like eyeballs. <laughs> it's supposed to be like to scare other creatures. Oh, we gotta use our perch. We gotta use our perch. Yeah, come here. Oh, it is new. Wait, it is new. Open your wings. I think it is new. It's less, um, it's less of a shiny blue. Those graphics are pretty good. Y'all, these are pretty good on Switch. Look at that. That's pretty good. Like the eyeball there. It's pretty good. I approve. I don't hate it. Such beautiful eye spots. Yes, make it pretty easy to figure out where its name comes from. <gasps> Brazilian owl butterfly. The Caligo Brazilianesis? Sure. 
I went on a walk the other day and seen so many butterflies and dragonflies. It was nice. Yes. I saw, uh, it's that time of year where there's a lot of dragonflies, like in fields and stuff. And so I saw some of those uh, just the other day. <gasps> She's standing up. She's grazing. Look at little Barbara. Oh no, where are you going? Where are you going? Hello? Don't leave. Come back. Come back. Guess she's just gonna chill over there. What else can I mess with this? Oh, I think I need to take a picture of this. Yeah, the bromeliad, right? Let's take a. There we go. We gotta make it a little aesthetic. We can't be doing the same like close-up picture of everything. All right, we did all the daytime activities, but we still have two. I think this is going to be night. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's got a little logo. This is a nighttime one, so we still have one more daytime butterfly to find. Excuse me. But where... Ooh, where would it be? Hello? Where? <gasps> the yellow ones? Ooh, pretty. Come here. Come to my perch. Come to my perch. So pretty. Look at that. <gasps> it looks like butter. It's so cute. It's. It looks like butter. It's yellow. That's really pretty. The other day I walked out of my house to go to work and there was a huge deer 10 feet from me and I jumped out of my skin. At least it was a deer and not a moose. Those things are terrifying. Okay, let me, um, they're so big too. Moose, meese, or meesen. They're very large. Where did, um, hello? I want a picture of you. Come here. Come on. Uh, do you have to just chill on a rock? Can it be more? Can we be more? Work with me. I wanted more than that. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. At least three. Yeah, replace. Let's do three. Butterflies are better than two. The fact that butter was the first thing you thought about, I don't know why I thought about that, JB. I don't know why. That's just this is how my brain is working this evening. I'm sure the simply spiked is not helping. I'm sure. I'm very lucky there are not moose where I am. Same here, Brie. I would be I would be like half wanting to like greet it and the other half being like terrified. Because like I love animals. So I'd be very attempt I would be very tempted to like approach it but like they're pretty territorial or like they could really do some damage with those antlers so I don't know so I'm glad that they I don't live near meese because <laughs> I would I would yeah it would be very it would be a, a terrible temptation for me I made it yes welcome in Roy how are you happy Friday I almost got one today too. Should have told me you were sipping today. Uh, I got not only JB. Did you tell me that these were good? Um, and I think you told me about you had the lemonade ones in particular. When I went home to visit my parents like a month ago, month and a half ago, um. I bought some of the lemonade ones and I left a bunch of them behind obviously because I bought like a little case and now my mom is like addicted to these things. <laughs> so now she's been buying them too. Like she's been buying like other flavors and so this is the same like 24 pack or whatever it was that my husband bought one evening and like that just shows that I don't drink all the time anymore but every now and again. So yeah this is 
you got you suggested to me that they were good i bought them and now my mom is like addicted to them <laughs> the domino effect yeah <laughs> glad today's friday long week agreed roy yeah yeah same um this week was long with my new job like i just finished my second week and i pretty much have a lot of it down now there's gonna be some like random things that come up that i'll have to ask my supervisor about but like i'm pretty confident in what i'm doing now um but it was still very long like the days were very long there was a lot of like clients coming in and checking in people because i work like the front desk so that part of it was long but it wasn't long in a bad way like it kind of except for today today this morning it felt it uh there it was busy and it felt long versus this afternoon it was busy but it went by really quickly so yeah there's there's a few different things but welcome in roy i am playing flutter away we are on day two this is supposed to be a quick game like 45 minutes to an hour so we'll probably finish this in stream tonight because I don't think I'm, I, I just, I think I'm determined to finish the game before I end stream. Um, we're on day two and by the looks of these tabs, I have a feeling there's probably five days in total um, until we finish it. So we're basically camping in the woods. We're looking for a capybara and taking pictures of butterflies and flowers. I want to steal the owl already. Isn't it cute? We're taking pictures of little butterflies and like observe, like doing observations of them and like doing little doodles. Look at the little floof butt of the capybara running away from us. Um, super cute. It's an exploration like photography game. I think this would do well on um, like a VR as well. There's like a cave over here. Oh, I can take a picture of the cave. <gasps> yes. I think it said five days at the beginning. Oh, Bree, look at you reading things. I don't read things, okay? I read and then I forget. I guess, let me rephrase. I read things and then I forget it. Look at that sunset. Ugh. I love this. Look at that. Are there sloths? Sloths are my favorite cozy animal. I wish. I don't know if there are. But that would be amazing. Owls are my favorite. We found owl feathers. And there's little doodles of owls. But we haven't come across any, unfortunately. So pretty. Uh, let's see. Hidden discoveries. A cave. I wonder how many hidden discoveries there are. That's what I want to know. Because day one, we found like five hidden discoveries. Like we got some cute little owls here because we found some owl feathers. We found some toucan feathers, a tree frog, a tree, and then like this butterfly fruit. I'm not sure what it is. They didn't really, it doesn't really tell you much. It just does a little doodle. But now we're on day two and so far one hidden uh, discovery. I guess I should just whip my camera out <laughs> and see what other hidden discoveries. Oh, a, fa it, a fallen tree could be a hidden, could that be a hidden discovery? Clothes could be a hidden discovery. Okay, let's try this. It's picking up clothes as something, so let's attempt it. I don't think so. It likes it lets you take a picture, but I don't know if it's a hidden discovery. All these butterflies, so pretty. Oh. Oh, I'm going to keep the old photo. I don't want to replace it. Oh, 
I can finally pick it up. Heck yes. Oh wait. Oh, dang it. Where can I put this? Let's put it... I couldn't pick it up earlier, but now I can. Hello? No. Chill. 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 No. Yeah. What? Are you kidding me? Calm. 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 I'm just gonna leave it there. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it there. I don't know. Something amazing, I guess. Um, what else could we find? There's gotta be another... There's gotta be... Well, it's not nighttime yet. Although there's gotta be a nighttime butterfly. Oh, what are these? What are these? Are these the same? Is this new? <gasps> are you new? You are. Look how pretty it's green. Gently place it. <laughs> Gently. No, Patrick. The lid. <laughs> the lid. <laughs> Gently. <laughs> Look at it, it's green. Ah, this is my favorite butterfly so far. And y'all know why. Oh, that is way too close to me, hello? Look at that, ah, oh, so pretty. Surely that one's new. Sleeping. Oh. This is precious. I'm dead. I'm dead. I have. I'm deceased. It should let you take a picture from the perch. Yes, Brie, exactly. That's what it needs. That is the one thing it's missing. <laughs> How do I take a picture of these? They're, they move, they like zoom zoom around. Hello? Oh. Are you getting sleepy? Did you wake up? Did I wake you from your nap? I love it. Look at Barbara. I said Barbara. Like it's an Animal Crossing character. It's a Barbara. <laughs> oh, no, come back. Come back. Come back. Jack. Jack. Come back. Come back, Jack. Come back. Oh. Come here, Dido. Hello? Heck yes. Look at that. Perfect. Um, I would rather replace it. I like this one better. Oh, that's the same one? Oh. I didn't even realize that was the same. Okay, well, we got a better picture of the Dido, y'all. Better picture. Better pizza. Papa John's. Okay, what is this? And why does it look like a snake? It's just a rope. Is there a creature in here? What's happening? Barbara has absolutely stolen my heart. Yeah. She's so cute. This looks like a snake. A snake. I'm not sure what it is, but I'm going to take a picture of it in case it's something important. We need to find more hidden things. What else is hidden? This is just a mushroom. They don't tell you. This isn't like um, smushy, smushy come home. Where it tells you the type of mushroom it is. It just says mushroom. That's kind of lame. 
kind of lame. They're more focused on the butterflies in this game. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, what else did we need to do? Is that it for first day? Or second day? Yeah. Oh, light my campfire. Hang. We're going to have to hang the lantern. That's why the lantern can be moved. Photograph the stars and photograph my campfire. Okay. Well, let's just go to nighttime. Let's do all the things. Okay, light my campfire. Oh. I placed this over here and now it fell. It's like I never did it. Where do I hang it? Here? Oh, it wants me to hang it there? Oh, this will take all day. Oh, this will take all day. This will take all day. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. What? I gently placed it. Come on. Boom. First try. <laughs> I did it first try. Uh, photograph the stars and photograph my campfire. I did. I photographed my campfire last night. Oh! <gasps> New species! Come here. Look at this moth. It looks like a leaf. Look at that. <gasps> it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Wait a minute. That's really pretty. Taking like s actual screenshots of some of these because it doesn't let me take a photo while it's in perch mode. This is actually really pretty. I'm like, I'm amazed by this game already. <laughs> I'm gonna be sad when it's done. I'm gonna be a little sad. Oh, so pretty. And it's purple with green eyes. Amazing. Uh, amazing. Okay, let's get a good picture here. Oh, wait, we gotta get we gotta get all the things. Hello? Flowers? Lilies? Whatever you are. Orchids. Yeah, I love it. Okay. Took a picture. We perched it. We discovered it. The pink bullseye moth. Okay, here we go. Attempting the official name. Lou Canella Apple Lou Canella Apollinierae Apple Lou Canella Apollinierae Is that how you say it? <laughs> I'm about to get this game. The level of detail is so nice. Yes, Brie. I definitely suggest getting it on sale. It came out earlier this month. I think like on I think it came out the 4th or 6th of August so it's still fairly new so if you want to get it at a more discounted price so right now it's like two dollars off I think um, but if you want to get it at a more discounted price I would suggest just add it to your wish list and then get it when it's more like discounted I got it for like two dollars because I had like coins saved up saved up um, but it's like twelve dollars regular price which actually isn't too bad but it's like a 45 to an hour game so if you don't mind that it's really short then maybe $12 isn't too bad but right now it's only like $10 and change right now um pleased I managed to hang my lantern tonight this little friend flew right to it thought the bullseye was cute at first now all I can see are those glaring pink eyes spooky we were talking about spooky season earlier we were talking about that spooky season earlier. Okay, what's what's this? Ooh, a new hidden. Oh. <laughs> I'm not sure what that is. A fallen tree is hidden. Interesting. Okay, this this uh, butterfly came out because I had this turned on. So I'm going to leave it turned on. What else did we need to do? 
Photograph the stars and then the campfire. Okay. Let's photograph the stars. Where are the stars? Hello? How do we... Oh! oh it's so pretty. Wait. Wait. Is that butterfly going to get into the frame? If it does, I want a picture of it. Hello? Come back. Hello? Come back to me. I'm just going to wait here and see if a butterfly comes back into frame because that was really cute. Come back. Yes. Uh, I wanted you higher up, but okay, fine. Fine. I kind of love this. I kind of love this. Okay, let's find a good angle here. Let's do like that. I like to have some of the trees in the background. Beautiful, beautiful. Photograph my campfire. We did that last night, but we'll do it again. Let's turn this back on. And then now let's photograph it. Let's do it from a different angle this time. Let's do it this way. We'll make sure we'll get a picture of the fruit in there too. I hope that counted. Oh, it didn't count. Okay, maybe this has to be turned off. Oh, it has to actually say campfire above it for it to recognize that it's there. Fine, we'll take a lame photo. It literally wants it in the center to recognize it. Fine. Fine. Not my tent opening after that happened. All right, we did all the things, but let's, uh, I wanna look at, I wanna look at my photos here. Look at all these cute photos. I like the stars. I like this picture, even though there's not a lot going on. This is cute too. What one would be my fave? I think this is my favorite. I don't know why. Well, I mean, come on, wait a minute. I think Barbara might be my favorite. Barbara might be my favorite. Mm-hmm. And this, okay, that's my favorite. That's my favorite. When it asks me what my favorite photo was, it's gonna be this one. What is this? I'm not sure, I'm scared. I'm scared to, I'm scared to press it. There should be another hidden discovery, though. Let's turn that back on. Um, let's see. Oh, can't go that way, because this hasn't broken down yet. What else would be new? A passion flower? It's recognizing this now? I didn't add it as a discovery, though. Hmm. This is such a nice game to follow along a stream. Yeah, it's just chill. I just, I'm just, I was ready to chill this evening. And this game just seemed like a good, just like, fluff around and find out. Or fluff around and hang out, maybe is how I should change the name of these streams moving forward. Like, just playing easygoing games. You don't really have to do much. <gasps> you don't have to think about it too much. <sighs> Barbara is so cute. Wait a minute. Ugh. I love her. Barbara better be our best friend at the end of these five days. She better be. You better be. She's so cute. <laughs> Y'all, it doesn't take a lot to make me like have the feels but Barbara is doing it she's doing it she has it always she has my heart but I've been streaming for an hour and a half it doesn't even feel like it's been that long see this is gonna take me more than 45 minutes to an hour y'all it's telling me to go to sleep and I'm like no 
I, refre I refuse. I must spend all my time with Barbara. <laughs> We're besties. I refuse to go to sleep. No. All right, Nightbot is telling me I need to take a break. So. I'm going to leave y'all on this screen. I'm going to... I'm going to quickly hide my little face. And I'm going to be right back. Because I'm going to use the restroom real quick. I'm going to refill. And I'll be right back. It'll take me like a minute or two. So, anyways. Enjoy the, the lovely tones of the campfire in the game. Let me, let me actually redo that. Because I accidentally got up. So, enjoy the hushed tones. And I'll be right back. Y'all enjoy the campfire. We're roasting marshmallows together. BRB. Hello again. <laughs> Back from the restroom. Replenished. Got a regular, just peach flavored, simply spiked drink. But I hope y'all enjoyed the cozy fire while I was gone. Lauren Davis. Welcome in, Lauren. I've been lurking, but I'm really enjoying this game to wind down from the day. Yes. Same. This is exactly what I needed after a long two weeks at the new job. Very nice, very, very smooth tones. And this crackling fire is exactly what I needed. It's it's camping without, without being outside in the heat. You know, it's just what I needed. And I don't think I could actually be camping for like five days straight. So 
This game already goes above and beyond in that regard. <laughs> I could not. I would- I could glamp, I could go glamping for five days, but camping like this for five days? Nay, nay, nay. No, no. Well, let's go to the next day. Feeling much more confident today, I sus- I sus- ugh, I can't read. I suspect this comes with familiarity and routine, though I am still fighting the urge to update my friends all the time. On a hugely positive note, I found three new species today. That's right, three. Hopefully, I'll find even more tomorrow. All right, our favorite photo of the day has got to be little Barbara, but not this one. It's got to be, got to be the daytime. Oh, I'm very tempted to do little sleepy Barbara here. And this one, the sunset's really pretty, but no, no, no. I'm gonna pick little Barbara with her little fluff butt. It's gotta be this, it's gotta be. Yep, that's it. Favorite photo of the day, come on, come on. I barely like being out for yard work, let alone being outside for over 24 hours. <laughs> yeah, same Brie. I miss what you're drinking tonight. Oh, so, yawn. I am having another Simply Spiked drink. Drink responsibly, people. Adults only, 21 and up. Obviously, I'm over the age. Um, so this is the peach flavored. I had, the one I just had was peach mango, and this is just strictly peach. So I'm drinking the signature peach Simply Spiked. It's got... 5% alcohol in it. But it's frye, so. Raise the, the, the roof? Is that what you say? Is that what the kids say nowadays? Sounds good. It's delicious. Day three. Oh no. Humid, sweaty, and sticky. Much warmer than yesterday. Almost too hot. That's literally what it feels like this summer right now. So like this is the joy of camping without the sticky humidity, gross heat that we have going in August. I awoke with a wave of confidence. The homesickness is gone and I'm excited to check up on my furry and fluttery friends. I feel a deep sense of comfort now, almost like this place is home. I'm, lo I'm loving these like little morning inspo logs. I see a tree frog in, in the distance. <gasps> okay, don't be jealous, but today is like our first chilly day here in Canada. Ugh, I Already, I'm 100% I'm jealous right now. Are you kidding me? Chilly day? Fallish? Ugh, I'm upset. <gasps> you know what I'm not upset about is this golden poison dart frog. Look at this. Three to four weeks early. It's supposed to be hot for another three to four weeks here. It's supposed to stay in the three digit Fahrenheit. For at least two, three weeks or something. Look at this guy. Oh, oh wait. I just hit the wrong button. Y'all, I had the perfect photo and I hit the wrong button. Maybe he'll do it again. I want him to face me. But we're supposed to get like another few weeks of like heat okay little dude wake up <laughs> he's so cute though why are the dangerous animals so cute yeah look at him he's poisonous but like i don't care look at that guy he's precious I live for this. Little Bean. Look at his, oh, his little face. I'm hoping he like gets up again. Can I, if I move around, will he move? Hello? Hello? <laughs> Not him looking at the camera, please. I liked when he was like up and, and facing me. He's so cute. Okay, I'm just gonna take a picture of him. I've, I've been staring at him for too long. Look at me again. Now he's not gonna look at me at all. Oh, there we go. 
perfect. Adorbs. Love to see it. Another hidden discovery. Oh! These little drawings are adorable. Come on. Come on. Okay, how many, um... How many... Oh, same. Two daytime butterflies, one nighttime. Okay, what are our activities? Pick fruit. Ooh, we get to pick the fruit for the capybara. Photograph passion flower. Look for mating butterflies. Mating? Hmm, okay. And clear the hill path. I, didn't, I read that as clear hell. <laughs> that is not right. That is not right. Okay. Um, oh, there's so many butterflies. I love it. Oh, wait, is this new? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, that's not new. But come to my perch. I don't think this is new. This is that leaf looking one. Oh, this is what it looks like in the daytime. <gasps> it's so pretty. This game is gorgeous. I love it. I love it. I officially love it. Oh, I don't need that on. It's daytime. Um, okay, we're looking for new butterflies, of course. We need to clear the path. So what path is it? Is it this path? No. We also need to take a picture of... There's a passion flower, right? Is that these? Oh no, that's a bromeliad. Uh, passion flower, passion flower. Is this a passion flower? Oh, it is. Okay, well, it's right here. Alright, one thing down. Look for mating butterflies. Clear the hill path. Um, this is the hill path, right? Right here? Oh, he's moving, wait. I love it so much. This little bean, look at him. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why is this little frog stealing my heart right now? Okay, what path am I clearing? Because I need to move on. This I'm going to be stuck on this frog for too long. Um, I'm assuming it's that path over there. Him handsome is right. Him is handsome. Where is this hill path I'm clearing? I'm assuming it was up there. Oh. 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 Wait, do it again. Do it again, do it again. Do it again. Oh my god, I'm dead. I'm deceased. Oh my god. Please. Please be. Oh, hello. Hello. Here you go. <gasps> I fed it. I fed Barbara. Oh, huh? she did a little dance. She's so happy. Wait, not me getting a picture where she's not happy. Oh. Y'all. Uh. Oh. She's so precious. Wait a minute. Oh, we're she's not running away either. I love her. <laughs> I love her so much. <laughs> Finally, about time I got to feed wee Cappy Barbara. I bet she'll be back tomorrow for sure. We are pretty good friends now. We are, <laughs> you know, as far as human rodent relationships go. Cappy Barbara or rodents? Wait. 
I feel like I knew this, but I need to Google it anyways. Um, capybara. Capybara. They are rodents. It, my husband is yelling at me in the other room. He says it's the world's largest rodent. Capybara are greater... Or greater capybara is a giant cavi rodent native to South America. It is the largest living rodent and a member of the genus Hydrochorus. The only other extent member is the lessy, lesser capybara. Oh my gosh, these words. Are you happy with yourself? He's dancing over here because he knew nerd facts about capybara. <laughs> Just, it fits with your capybara sticker. Hello, little Miss Kylie. Welcome in. How do you know the sad story of capybaras? Its close relatives, y'all, we're learning today. Its close relatives include guinea pigs and rock cavies, and it is more distantly related to the chinchilla. Oh. It inhabits savannas and dense forests and lives near bodies of water, so it's over here near the waterfall. It is highly social species and can be found in groups as large as a hundred, but usually live in groups of ten to twenty. Well, little Cappy Barbara here is all by itself. Don't make me sad. <laughs> Aww, it's all by itself. Well, maybe, maybe we'll be its friend. Do I know? Th oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to know the sad story. <laughs> I don't want to know a sad story about capybaras right now. No, thank you. Yeah, Google it on your own time. We're here for the, we're here for the cuteness. We're not here for the sadness. <laughs> Look at her adorbs. Okay. Oh. She's cute. She's cute. Okay. <laughs> Phew. <laughs> we don't need... We don't need the sadness this evening. Not at all. I love these little pictures. These little doodles. This one's cute. Alright, let's look at... Um, let's look for the place we need to... Clear... That is next on the list. I'm assuming it's up here, but it wouldn't let me it wouldn't let me do anything to it just yet. But maybe now? Maybe we're supposed to find the butterflies first. Hmm. All the butterflies that I see buzzing around, buzzing, uh, flying around have been... have been the ones we've seen already. It's it's wanting us to go back here though. Like what else is here? Is it cuz of this butterfly? Oh, it is. <gasps> okay. Come here. Come here. Join my perch. Hello? Join my perch. Hello. Oh, there we go. Look at this. It's so pretty. It's like a reddish color, like a red, black, and white. It's so pretty. Wait, it's so pretty. Glad I didn't say it avoided being banned. I wouldn't ban you, John. Yawn. <laughs> look how pretty this is. It kind of looks like a cardinal, y'all. Look at that. Look at that. I love it. So pretty. I gotta take a screenshot of that. Okay. Um, let's get a legit picture. Let's get a picture with Barbara in it. Cute. I love it. Alright, let's read about it. Let's see. Where are you at? Right here. Alright. Uh, Kramer's 88. What? Dithyria. Clymena. 
<laughs> okay. Wha Whoa, creative naming. A butterfly with two eights. Oh, with two eights on its wings called an 88. Kramer's 88. Where's, uh, where's Qu Quagmire when you need him? <laughs> Inspired. Is this butterfly flirting with me? It keeps blowing kisses with the red on its wings. This is so cute. I like that they added like little watercolor splotches here. Oh, what else do we unlock? Oh. There's some sort of tree that roots like this. It looks like feet. Interesting. This little poison frog is so cute. This is, yes. Okay, so this is a Nintendo game that I purchased. It is currently on sale. It's like $2 off, but it's like um, almost 11 bucks right now, which isn't really that much. But warning, this game is apparently only 45 to an hour long, like 45 minutes to an hour long. So if you don't want to spend that much money on something that's kind of short, I would suggest wishlisting it. But yes, this is on Switch. And it's, it looks pretty, pretty dang good, to be honest. I'm quite pleased with how uh, this looks on the Switch. Normally you don't get graphics like this um, outside of Steam, to be honest, so pretty good. I think it would be a lot more fun. Oh, her little fluff butt, I cannot. You're so cute, I can't, I die. I li I did, I'm dead deceased is she just gonna walk past me <gasps> we're bffs now wait a minute we're bffs hello what are you doing what uh, uh. i've never been so in love with an inanimate object um i'm gonna keep the old photo because you can actually see the butterfly in it but I love this photo so much. <laughs> I'm still going to keep that photo because it's in my... It should be in my journal here. Yeah, here we go. Oh, can you tell that I love the poison frog and Barbara here? It speaks for itself. I mean, look at her. Look at her. Look at her... This is adorable. I can't. I can't. It's adorable. Okay. We're looking for mating butterflies. So we found one. We gotta find another. And then we gotta clear the hill path. <gasps> She's asleep. Okay, wait a minute. 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 Okay. Enough. Barbara, stop. You're too much. Oh. Oh my god, uh, you're so cute. Okay, we gotta find a new butterfly. Gotta find these mating butterflies. Can we clear the path now? Or no? Maybe this isn't the path. It said hill path, so let's see. Oh, running into my fire here. What would be a hill path? I would assume it'd be uphill, which is that way. It is. She's so cute. She's adorable. Oh. Oh, for a second I thought I woke her up. I'm just like, I feel terrible if I woke you up. Please. Where else would be... Where else would butterfly? <laughs> Where else would there be a butterfly? Hello? There's so many of these blue ones, the little butterflies. Look at her little fluff butt. What are you doing? Are you just going for a little jaunt? Hello?
Is there a demo? Um, I don't think there's a demo for this. I think probably because it is kind of short, they didn't include a demo. But this is on Switch, and it's also on Steam. Um, in fact, those are the only places you can play this game, I realized. I don't think it's on uh, PlayStation or Xbox or anything. But yeah, there's no demo. I think it's because it's just really short. How do I find these mating butterflies? Hello? Where are you? Where you be? I'm pretty sure this is what I need to clear, but maybe I'm wrong. This little tree frog, ugh, kills me. Kills me. Maybe it's over here. Let's go down here. We haven't been down here. Oh, oh yeah. It said earlier in the game that you need to follow the sun rays. So here we go. I should have been doing this. I should follow instructions. I tell Sean to always follow instructions. Or to look up his map. And I don't do the same. Are these the same butterfly? They look different. They look different. Yeah, they're different. They're different colors. That's a new species. Open your wings, buddy. Open your wings. There we go. I actually kind of like its wings closed. So I'm going to keep it like that. I'm going to keep a... Uh, yeah, let's replace. I like this one better. I like this one better. Capybaras are officially your favorite animal. Same here. They're so cute. Alright, what are we going to learn about this butterfly? The queen? Ooh, swallowtail. Or Papilio and Drogus. I caught these two mating today as proving to be some sort of messed up butterfly Valentine's Day. Look at, look at this picture. This little doodle here. Adorable lover flies. I was lucky enough to see both a male and female of these species. Oh, that was a, the same one. <gasps> ah. So I guess this is the the female one, and then this one was the f the male, because the males are usually more colorful. So this is probably the female that's that's right here. Interesting. Oh, because of where we're standing, we couldn't see that this tree fell over. <laughs> so funny. Oh look, there's more here. Yes, I love that picture better. Yeah. Cute. Now we got both species there. Okay, awesome. All right, we did that. Let's go. Let's go clear the path. Let's go discover new things. Okay, this is where we should clear. There we go. Look at our little guy, our little guy Carl here. Look at little Carl. Look at him being all Carl as it's turning nighttime. <laughs> oh, I love it at night. So pretty. So magical too. Look at all these mushrooms. Okay, what are we discovering? Come to my perch. Hello? Perch. I love capybaras and I love frogs. <laughs> They're gonna be besties. Yes. <laughs> Look at this. The, like, wind has picked up in this, like game too. Look at this. This game is truly so pretty. 
All right, let's take a photo of these little guys here. Zoom out a bit. Here we go. Oh, I got little Barbara in the back. I didn't even realize she was back there. I love that she was back there. Oh my God, that's cute. Okay, let's read about him. All right. The Bois Duval's horned devil moth. Mm. Another species I got to see both a male and female of. Oh, okay, they were right side beside each other. Love is in the air today. One of these devils was totally third wheeling during courtship. Awkward. This is so cute, these little doodles. It's like the little infinity, like they've been flying around each other. I love that. I love that Barbara is in the back too. Like, look, there she is way back there. <laughs> you can barely see her little face, but she's there. I'm gonna doodle a capybara in my notebook. Do it, do it. Capybaras are so cute. Okay, what else do we have in our journal to do? Photograph uh, a glowing mushroom and sit down and relax. Have we found any hidden things today? Yeah, we found a few. I wonder how many hidden items there are. Oh! She has graced us with her presence. I wonder how many hidden items there are in the game. I'm gonna have to look those up. I would love to capture everything in a gameplay. I'm, I'm a completionist. I like to find everything. Mushroom and a big tree. Um, let's do it from a different angle. Let's go... Let's go this way. I'm trying to be aesthetic here. Nice. Glowing mushrooms. Added. Oh! A toucan! Toucan Sam, right here. Right here, y'all. Right here. Look at that. He's right there. I love that. I like it. I don't hate it. The little doodles! So cute! Okay, I need to look up more. Okay, let's get a... Let's get a... Let's get a better picture of this little guy here. Zoom out a bit. Nope, wrong, wrong button. Let's zoom out. There we go. I want to get those mushrooms in there too. I like it. Okay, cool. What else is around? We've got more mushrooms. I need to look up more. I don't look up enough. If I wouldn't have looked up, I wouldn't have seen his little his little face over there. Oh! I need to look down, too! Look at little Barbara. <laughs> She's so precious. I can't. How many sleeping pictures am I going to get of Barbara here? I'm going to keep the old photo because you can see the butterflies more and she's still in the background. But oh my god, all these sleeping photos of her. I can't. It's a beautiful little animal. Yes. <laughs> it's so cute. I'm shaking all the trees in case I discover something new. This is so cute. Oh, there's more feathers. Oh, we got to get a picture. A macaw, a macaw feather. There's macaws. Another hidden thing. <gasps> oh, macaws are so pretty. If we see a macaw on one of these days, I have got to take a picture of it. That's so, oh, sorry, Barbara. They're so pretty, they're so colorful. Um. We took, uh, my husband and I took his youngest to the zoo and we saw some macaws there up close and they were so pretty. They're also like 
Very smart. <laughs> What you doing, Barbara? I could just watch her walk around all day long. I really could. Ooh, I like this with my campsite in the back. Oh wait, ooh, 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 ooh. Light bulb idea. I'm gonna turn my campfire on and then go back to that spot and then take a picture. Sorry, Barbara. Sorry, sorry. I gotta light up the campfire, enjoy enjoy the heat. That's worth the $11? Yes, it really is. This is worth it. I only spent 11, or I only spent $2, but it would be worth it for me if I spent the, uh, the full 11. Okay, let's take a picture now. Ooh, can we get Barbara back there? <gasps> I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait until she goes back and then take a photo. Barbara the Capybara, yes. She 100% is worth the $11. I think it's only on sale for another week, too, I think. I'm pretty sure. I can't remember if it was this game or the other one that I bought that was... The sale was active for like nine days or so. Um, but I bought it like two nights ago, so I think we're down to a week now. Gotta head out, but have a good stream. Thanks, Bree. Have a good one. Thank you for stopping in. And thank you for those that come and like the stream on your way out. I appreciate y'all. I'm waiting for Barbara to go back in the background, by the way. I'm not just staying on the screen. I want her to walk back. Because I want to capture her little face in the back. But she's very slow, so it's going to take her a minute. If we learned anything, she's basically a rodent. But I'm waiting for her to walk back. And then we'll go to sleep and we'll start day four. Only two more days left. So not much longer. But I'm definitely, um, I'm definitely getting my money's worth because I've been streaming for about a little over two hours now. Come on, Barbara, where you at? Is she all the way up here now? Oh, she's headed back, I think. She's headed back. She has to be. Five days remaining for the sale of... Oh, five days. Oh, thank you, thank you. Okay, so there's five days left to get it on sale. Sale. If y'all want to get it. Is she going to walk back? Hello? Barbara? Where you at, girly? Where you at? She's not even down here. Where is she? Where'd you go? Oh! She's up here. She's up here. Y'all, I can't. Her little foot. Her little foot. <laughs> She's got her little foot kicked out. Oh, is she getting up? Okay, you going back? Okay, if she goes back, I'm gonna go back over there and try and take a picture. <laughs> Alright, take your time, girly. It's okay. Take your time. Let's try to zoom in. I'm just gonna wait for her. Hopefully, that's where she's headed. <laughs> Let's hope. Patience, y'all. Patience. I think it'll be worth it. I think it'll be worth it. There she goes. <gasps> I see her. I see her. I'm going to take one from her walking that way. And if she comes back, I'm going to take another one. Watch her, like, go lay down over there, and it's going to take 50 years for her to come back. Oh, she's coming. She's coming back. There she is. Okay. All right. That was worth it. Okay. Now let's go to sleep. She's going to go rest. We're going to go rest. Night, 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 Barbara. 
We will see her in the morn. Sit down and relax. Our tent should be open. Yep, let's go to sleep. All right, night log. Today was so much fun, so fascinating to see so many behaviors in one day. A little bit cliche romantic with all the courting and flirting going on. Regardless, I'll have to remember to tell my partner about today. They're the romantic one after all. It's a cloudy evening tonight. Perhaps I'll finally see some rain tomorrow. Hmm. I have beautiful photo skills. Thank you. <laughs> you gotta capture the moment. All right. What was our favorite photo? This is gonna be hard. I've been capturing more and more photos every day. Like the first day I was kind of lenient. Day two, I took quite a bit more. And then day three, I outdid myself and did so, so many. Welcome in, Sophia Grace. How are you doing? I hope you are well on this lovely Friday evening. We're enjoying nature, capybaras, poison tree frogs, butterflies, flowers, all the things. Camping. Select your favorite photo. Oh, this is hard. I love this little frog guy. But I love this too, where she's like, Barbara is the capybara's name, Cappy Barbara. Um, she's reaching for fruit, that's adorable. She's sleeping, that's adorable. She's sleeping here, that's adorable. The toucan is cute. I think I took another like up close sleeping photo of her, right? Yeah, right here with a little fluff butt. Her back here with the campsite. Good, this game sounds aesthetically pleasing. Yes, it has been, it really has been. This is on Switch and on Steam. Came out like a week ago, like early August. Um, I bought it myself, so this is my true interactions and reactions to the game. When you can only choose one, but you love them all. And yes, that's, a, that's my, my issue. I think I'm gonna pick this one because it's in the daytime. She's like stretching for some fruit. She's, she's so cute. It has to be her because I've taken so many pictures of her. Favorite photo of the day. I love that. I love it. I don't hate it. I don't have enough Nintendo Switch money for it. How much uh, does it cost? Okay, so it is currently on sale for the next five days. Um, it was originally, it's originally 12 US dollars, but it's on sale for like, well, I think it's closer to like 13, but it's on sale for like 11 and change. And it is raining today, y'all. We're gonna get some, we're gonna get some ASMR rain here in just a moment. I'll turn up the sound so y'all can enjoy. Um, so, but right now it's like 11 and change, but I had a lot of, I bought two games two nights ago. This game and, oh my god, I cannot remember the name of the other game now. But um, I basically spent like $3 and like 50 cents on two games. And it's because I had like gold coins like saved up um, on my Nintendo account. And I had like $2 in, um, in like wallet balance too. So I was able to get both games um, for basically three bucks and change. So if, uh, I will say this game is kind of short. It's supposedly only supposed to take you like 45 minutes to an hour to beat. I'm like prolonging it because y'all know that I just take my time with games. So um, if 11, $13 of a game is too steep for how long it is, I would suggest wishlisting it and just waiting until it gets on a, on a better sale. It's only been out for a little bit now, like a couple weeks or a week and a half. And so I'm sure it will come on sale even more so like later on. But it is raining on day four. Um, there's only five days of content, so that just shows you how short it is. I'm almost two and a half hours in and we're on just starting day four. 
My boots are soaked. I'm going out anyways. There are still more species to find besides. All's well as long as there's a dry place to sleep. 100%. I bet she loves the rain. I bet she loves it. So you know what we're going to do for a second, y'all? Let me turn this on. Turn on our little lamp. Um, I can't turn on the campfire yet. But we're going to sit here. We're going to enjoy the rain for a second, okay? I'm going to... I'm going to turn up the sounds of the game. Me speed running Animal Crossing for the app. I need the Nook phone. Um, I'm going to turn the sounds up on the game. And we're going to enjoy a little bit of this. They're aquatic? Oh, capybara. Yeah, they like swimming. Yeah. So there's capybara in, um, in um, Smushy Come Home, which is another game that I played on Switch that I purchased myself. I beat that game. That game was so much fun. If you want a game that you can play for longer than this one, um, I believe it's only... Let me look it up. Smushy Come Home. Hmm... So Smushy Come Home is a $20 game, so it costs a little bit more, but it's, it's a longer game. But it's so much fun, and there's so many things to discover in that game. I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Um, if you don't want to spend $20, bucks, wish list it, of course. Wait till it comes on sale. But that is a game I definitely recommend, and it also has Capybara in it as well. So if you like capybara, if you like cute little mushroom characters that you can play as, you can you unlock like different like mushroom heads and uh, hats, I guess I should say, for the character. I definitely suggest Smushy Come Home. Definitely, it's got capybara in it. So if you like cute little capybara in this game, you'll love the capybara in that game. But yeah, that's that's what it reminded me of when you said they're aquatic. But I'm gonna turn up the sounds. We're just gonna sit here for a second. Just enjoy the rain and the music. And I'm gonna—I'm not gonna mute myself, but I'm gonna push the mic away from me. Actually, you know what? I am gonna mute myself while we enjoy this. Beautiful. So beautiful. Hope y'all took that for a second to stretch. I actually ended up popping my neck, which I never do. Um, but that was nice. That was nice. The rain is 100% needed. Oh my goodness, this game is amazing. It's amazing, y'all. It's amazing. Okay, let's see what our to-dos are. Let's see. Again, three butterflies. There seems to be a theme here. There's always two during the day, one at night. And <laughs> beautiful ASMR, yes. Oh, we're supposed to follow Cappy Barbara. We're supposed to photograph a purple uh, bromeliad. Photograph wet clothes and walk through each trail. In the nighttime, we're unsure as to what we have yet. All right, well, let's, uh, where are these wet clothes? Is it our clothes? Oh, yeah, these. Look at these wet clothes. Oh, no. They are wet. We have wet clothes. Let's take a picture of those. And then... 
what did it say? Far follow Barbara. Oh, a purple um, bromeliad. I think there's some over here, right? Is that what this is? Yeah. Let's take a picture of the, these two. Yeah, because there, there's green ones and then purple ones. Oh, that's pink. That's not even purple. Wait a minute. That's not purple. I'll have to find the purple ones. Um, where's um, Cappy Barbara? Where'd she go? I think she went this way. Pretty sure. Let's go find her. Let's go find her bestie. Bestie, where you at? Hello? Oh, a new, a new. They're so cute. Wait. Come to my perch. Let's take a close up on this. Are these, um, are these just yellow, like regular yellow butterflies? I've seen them in Animal Crossing. <laughs> I've seen these in Animal Crossing. Are they the same? They're so pretty though. Look at that. Oh, with the, with the freaking waterfall in the back. Are we kidding? Adorbs. Okay, let's take a photo of them. I like things in the background. It's gotta be... It's gotta make sense. It's gotta be aesthetic. Okay, what are these called? The Cloudless Sulfur. Phoebus Sinei. Sulfurs flutter easily when scared, especially when a human comes along shaking the tree they're in. Oops. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> these are one of the most common species. Oh yeah, common yellow butterfly. Those are in Animal Crossing. I'm surprised I haven't seen any up until today. I love the little rain, the little doodles. I've seen it in Animal Crossing too, yeah. Common yellow butterfly, or a cloudless sulfur. I like it. I don't hate it. What is this? Oh, it's the green ones. I love the green ones. Look at this. They're so pretty. So pretty. Open up, little buddy. Open up. You want to open? I'll release you. I'll let you do your thing. Okay, so that's one butterfly. We had to go down um, all the paths, so let's continue. Let's go down a different path. Let's go find somebody else or something else. Let me turn this music down just a smidge. I feel like it's kind of loud. Y'all let me know if, if you cannot hear me. Because I feel like I'm trying to turn up the sounds quite a bit. Um, so y'all could hear the in-game music. But let me know. Oh, this one's purple. Let me know if, um, if you can't hear me. Okay. Let's get a little close-up of this. Nice. Did that count? Oh wait, it didn't count. Ugh. You have to do it just so, so it like has the word above it. Okay, let's, let's do it again. There we go. We did it. You can hear me perfectly fine? Okay, good. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, we're supposed to follow um, Cappy Barbara, but we also have to walk down each trail, so let's do that first. Oh, we already got it, because we, we walked down both trails. What is that? <gasps> another frog! Wait, y'all, there's another frog! Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. There's another frog. A milk frog? What? Heller? Heller. <gasps> I thought I liked the yellow one more. Look at this little blue guy. It's Jeremiah from Animal Crossing. Amazon milk frog. That must be what Jeremiah is. He's a frog villager, a blue frog villager in Animal Crossing New Horizons, y'all. <gasps> it's so cute. Can you sit up like you were before? Oh my god, I'm dead. You're so cute. Y'all. Game! So cute! 
I die. Oh, look at this little, look at this little doodle. That's precious. He's your dreamy. I've had him on an island before. He was on my, I had him on my um, kid core island. I loved him. I loved Jeremiah. He was such a good villager. Loved him so much. Oh. So he's an Amazon milk frog, probably. I don't know why I'm moving this tree. Let's move that out of the way. You are adorable. Like, I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to say to you. You're adorbs. Like, truly. How many pictures of a frog can I take? Apparently a zillion. Okay, there's nothing really to see down here. I wish there was like an owl or something in this perch. Maybe eventually there will be. But right now, there's nothing. <gasps> He's moving. He's moving. Yeah, there we go. That's a good fit picture of him. Yeah. Hello, Joydy. Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome to the stream. Happy Friday. Alright, let's go... Let's go find Barbara, who is a capybara. Where is she? She must... She must have gone this way. I don't know where else she would have gone. Let's take a picture of the yellow bromel brome bromeliad. That might be a secret item. Oh, it's a Saturday for you. Are you in uh, Australia? Actually, you know what? You don't need to tell me where you are. <laughs> you don't have to tell me that. But you're living in the future. I hope the future is nice. I hope the future is bright. Let's see. Okay, it wasn't a hidden discovery. I thought it would be. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, I don't I don't want I don't wanna dox nobody. I don't wanna you don't have to tell me where you where you live. That was a silly question of me to ask. <laughs> when it gives me the option to to touch leaves, I shall. Oh, there's some uh <gasps> here she is. What are you doing over here, little girl? Chidurin. Besides being adorable. More toucan feathers. Ugh, oh, I love her. Okay, new butterfly. Come here. Where are you going? Come here. Come here. Come here. It looks like a leaf. Look at this. <gasps> it's so pretty. Wait, you're adorable. Wait, wait, you're freaking adorable. Are you kidding? Come on. This is so pretty. They really look like leaves. Like even more so than some of the others. I have so many screenshots on my... On my switch. Oh uh, wait, no, not journal yet. Let's take a let's take a picture of these all together like this. Yeah, there we go. Nice. All right, now let's read about them. Okay, magnificent leaf wing butterfly, or um, say no flea. Oh, there's thunder. Cenophlebia arcadonia, or arcadona, a beautiful brown butterfly on a blah rainy day. Oh, look at this. It's pretty. I needed a little sunshine today. I didn't realize leaf wings hide some inside their wings. I love that. Oh, where are you going? Or did she get scared? <gasps> did she get scared? It's okay. 
Cappy Barbara got scared, y'all. We gotta go. We gotta go check on her. But for, but before I do that, let me. Oh, all the butterflies are staying still now. Yeah, I also have a million pictures of my Animal Crossing islands, my villagers, all the things. Same here. What else did we capture? Oh wait, wait, where is it? It's it showed a it showed a toucan in a in a tree. Do you think it's in that oh it's it's over here. You remember that spot that, that like vine that was hanging and I was like, what's gonna go here? I thought it was the house for a bird. And I think it is. Let's go back and find it. Okay, I don't I'm not sure where Cappy Barbara went. But the toucan should be over here. In the photo it was, but maybe not. Oh, we found the nighttime butterfly. Hello? Come to my perch. Ah, oh, so pretty. This one has, ooh, this one has the scary eyes. Wait, okay, open your wings again. Open your wings again. This is one of those, like, moth-looking things that has the scary eyes. Look at that. Look at that. Cappy Barbara got jump-scared? Yes, she did. Poor thing. Okay, let's take a photo of these. I wish one of them would, like, close their wings. Ooh, that lightning. That lightning, though. There we go. Yes, I wanted to. Ca I wanted to capture the eyes. Perfect. Okay, let's read about this. Poor Barbara. Exactly. Poor thing. Poor ting. A bullseye moth. Auto Maris Luberia. A bullseye flashed me just as well to. I could have missed it as a dead leaf. Oh, goodness. Wish I had an umbrella today. At least moths can pull their wings over themselves. <laughs> a bullseye? A brill. Love to see. Oh, where is she? Oh, no. Are you okay? What's happening? What's happening? I can't see anything. What's happening? Where'd you go? Oh, no. Everything got ruined. Wait a minute. Everything's ruined. Ah. Okay, put that back. Put that back. My goodness, this storm is like really tearing things up over here. Thank you for the stream. Have a great night. Gotta head out. No worries, Yon. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for liking the stream on your way out. Appreciate you. We're, you're, we're getting close to done, but obviously no worries if y'all need to leave. I have been streaming for like two and a half hours. Oh, what is happening over here? Is this the waterfall? Where did Barbara go? We didn't check down here. My dog is drinking water, if you hear anything in the background, by the way, y'all. I think that's just the waterfall. Where did she go? Okay, what are our nighttime activities? Photograph an orchid. Um, photograph my tent. Sit after rain eases and photograph a capybara. Okay, we gotta find... We gotta find Barbara. We gotta go find her. She's... She's hiding. She's scared. Um, let's take a picture of an orchid, though. It, they open up when you look at them, so... Let's, let's let that open, and then we'll take a picture. Beautiful, beautiful. I love orchids. They're some of my favorite um, flowers. Oh wait, the tent's messed up too. There we go. We fixed it. Okay, now we need to find Barbara. Okay. I think the rain has calmed down a bit, so maybe she'll come out. We need to take a picture of her though. Okay, hey, hold on one second, y'all. Let, um, let me pause, or not pause. Let me mute and tell my dog to stop drinking water. My 
My dog doesn't know how to drink in moderation, y'all, so I have to monitor his drinking habits. <laughs> but I'm back. I am back. Okay, let's go find um, Barbara. Where you at, little girl? Where could you be? I need to take a picture of her. It showed... Oh, I forgot about this frog. I was like, oh my god, what is that? It showed a toucan in one of these, but not here. Let's go find her. Maybe she's, um, maybe she's back at the hill path. Um, I think it wants me to sit here, but I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait for a second. She'll probably come out once I sit down, but I want to double check. Is that that? Oh yeah, it's one of those leaf ones. I was like, is that a leaf or a, or a butterfly? Should have known. Should have known. Okay, she's not up here. I bet if we sit down, she'll come out. So let's go do that. Poor Barbara. She got scared by the lightning. Uh, poor thing. Alright, let's go sit down. Sit after rain eases. There she is. She came back out. Adorable. <gasps> Wait, what are you doing? Are you coming to... Are you coming to hang out with me? Oh. Y'all. Uh. I must protect her. She's adorable. Are you kidding me? I can pet her. Wait, wait, wait. I can pet her. Y'all. Don't laugh at me. She. Uh. I'm deceased. I'm deceased. She's adorable. I love her. Must protect all the things. <gasps> She's so cute. Are you kidding? Uh. Me too. I'm also dying from cuteness. She's so cute. What else did I unlock? Uh, me starting a fire. Oh, wait. Uh, pressing the wrong buttons. Okay. Animal friendship increase. Yes. I thought I'd lost Cappy Barbara today. She ran into the storm before everything went wrong. But came back right when I needed her. She even let me have some cuddles. A perfect end to a trying day. I love her so much. Where'd she go? Oh. You are the most majestic little thing. Little thing. I love you. Are you kidding? You are a model. You're a model. You're a straight model. Are you kidding me? Straight model. Look at this. I'm gonna pet her again. I can't not pet her. She's like cooing. She sounds like my boxer <laughs> when I pet him. I'm in love. I'm in love. Photograph an orchid and photograph my tent. Ugh, I mean, with this cutie over here, we need to photograph other things. Fine. 
Fine. I will comply, I guess. But I'm gonna try and put Barbara in the picture. Yeah, there we go. Photograph my tent with a little, little fluff butt in the back. And now an orchid. Okay, let's do... Same thing. I'm gonna try and get her in the background. Yeah, we always gotta put Barbara in it. If we can, I'm gonna put her in it. All right, we finished all the nighttime activities, daytime. We got all the butterflies. Fluff butt, yes, she's a little fluff butt. Look at that little fluff butt. Look at her. She's about to get up. I'm not sure what she's gonna do, but if she starts walking, I'm following her. Where are you going? What are you doing? You gonna sleep? Oh. Y'all. I just stood up and my knee sounded like bubble wrap popping. Oh no. JB. My knees sound like that when I go, when I walk up the stairs to go to bed. Or if I have to go get something upstairs. They sound like bubble wrap. My knees. Yeah. Specifically when I'm like walking upwards. That sounds awful. You're too young to have knees that sound like that. You're too little. If I need a burst of happiness and serotonin, I'm going to play this game with headphones on. And I don't even have to do anything. I can literally just sit here in silence with the music turned up. Like, listen to this. Okay. <laughs> I hate to do it, but let's start day five. Ugh, the final day. Let's go. Oh, let me also, um, let me fix my camera a bit, because I'm, like, leaning back now, because my posture is awful. Actually, let me fix my mic and my chair. Hold on. Hopefully you can still hear me. I lowered the mic a bit. Oh man, this is going to be even harder to find a good picture for this day. Nar, day five. It's going to be harder to find a favorite photo from day four. Ugh. All right. The weather scared my cappy barber friend, sent the butterflies into hiding, and washed out my campsite. Yep, I got a little overwhelmed, but I managed it. One thing at a time, I managed it. Staying positive is so important. I can certainly say that I have a story to take home. Besides, the rain will make my last day even better. All right, favorite photo of the day. This is this model. This model. Okay, you know what? I need help. I need help. Picking out the best photo. Y'all. <laughs> this is hard. Okay, well these are all from day three. And here's the start of day four. So we're not going to pick any of those. So, I'm going to do a poll really quickly. Very quick poll. We're going to pick. We've got tree frog. Look at the tree frogs. Little, little Jeremiah buddy here. Because he's adorable. And then we've got Barbara in the left hand corner. So we got tree frog. 
or Barbara? Let's do a quick poll. I have a feeling. I have a feeling it's going to be Barbara. But I want to do a poll anyways. So vote to your little content. We're going to we're going to first vote for which creature, the tree frog or the capybara. And then we'll vote for the picture, okay? But we gotta narrow it down to species first. So y'all vote. And then whichever the winner is, we'll vote on the specific photo for this lot for uh, day two, I mean day four, because this is just gonna be so difficult. Look at all these little Barbara pictures. And then look at the, look at the little tree frog. Look at little Jeremiah here, come on. This is so diff- this is the most difficult day. Y'all vote Barbara or Tree Frog. Ugh, look at little Miss Model. Look at her. This is a- <sighs> So many good ones. This one's good, this one's good, that one's good. This one's cute. And then we got a little dude here. I mean, come on. Ugh. Come on. Okay. How's the poll going? Barbara, duh. <laughs> That's true. She's a contender. She's quite the contender. Look at her. Ugh. Okay. I mean, clearly Barbara's the winner here. Clearly Barbara's the winner. All right. I'm going to end the poll. So, three. I'm going to end the poll in ten seconds. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Ending the poll. Next poll. We are going to decide on. We're going to decide on. This is number one. We got the close up of Barbara, number one. So top right, number one. Bottom left, number two. Or bottom middle, number three. One. This model over here. One, two, or three. This is hard. One, two, whoop, two, or three. Y'all vote. We got one. Remember, one over here. Close up of her. Two over here. Her enjoying the campsite. Or three over here. Model staring at us. I mean, all three of these are model. She's like, nah, she's like sleeping over here and the fire's behind her. She's staring up at us. <sighs> Y'all are all saying three. I feel, I have a feeling three is the winner. I am torn between one and three. Like this is cute, cute. So cute. But this is pretty, pretty dang cute. It's pretty dang cute. She's adorbs. She's stealing all the hearts tonight. I like this one too, but like, I like these close-ups of her, so I'm kind of torn between one and three. Oh yeah, y'all say three? Surely, okay, you know what, we're done. <laughs> we're done. The third one has got to be the photo of the day. Yes, this has to be it. Oh, look at this one though. Look at that one. Look at it. Oh, so cute. All right, photo of the day, number three. 
cute. Love to see it. Ah, uh, look at her. Adorable. Okay, let's start day five, y'all. Final day. What do we have? Sunshine with a gorgeous rainbow dancing on the mist of the waterfall. <gasps> We've got to take a photo of the waterfall, y'all. She is precious. She's so precious. It's my final day. You can tell that from my journal since it's running dangerously low on page space. But I'm still hoping to document as much as I can. All right. What do we have to do today? What are our to-dos? Okay. Um, three butterflies yet again. Oh, hit the nighttime butterfly they put in the middle this time. No, not the final day. Yes, unfortunately, this is the final day. But I have stretched this game out probably further than the developers thought. Because <laughs> I've been streaming for almost three hours now. Um, so, okay, our activities for the daytime. Follow Cappy Barbara. Photograph a rainbow. Okay, that's part of our things. Play with a hanging vine. We've already kind of done that, but we'll do some more. And then photograph a yellow bromeliad. All right, let's go find... <gasps> Look at... I already see the rainbow. Let's go to the rainbow. Look at the rainbow, y'all. Oh my god, she's enjoying the rainbow. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I gotta take a picture of her with the freaking rainbow. Are you kidding me, model? I want a longer version. Look how cute she is. Uh, are you freaking kidding me? This. Y'all probably think I'm like over exaggerating, but like I am very. It doesn't take a lot for me to really love a game. Smushy come home. I had the exact same reaction. I didn't stream it or anything. But I had the exact same reactions playing that game as I am with this one. This is so cute. I need to follow her though. Oh, where are you going? Hello? Where are you going? Oh. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a frickin' second. <sighs> she has babies, y'all. She has freaking little tiny babies. <gasps> oh my. For. Can I pet them? <gasps> I can pet the babies. Y'all, y'all, I can pet the babies. Flavors Farm <laughs> says howdy, Ribo Raid, welcome in, Raiders. Y'all came in the most adorable moment. There are freaking capybara babies. Look at Bald Guys Gate Raid, please. I love that you y'all call it Bald Guys Gate though. <laughs> Look at this. She is entrusting me with her babies. This is Cappy Barbara. Y'all, welcome in. If y'all uh, aren't aware of Ribo, my pal here, um, he obviously streams and does little cozy content over on his channel. Bald guys in the house. Wow. Welcome in, Razmataz, Star, McBeal. JB, I, feel, I have a feeling you were probably watching both streams, but welcome in again. They have tiny little fluff butts, yeah. Oh my god. 
I... I, I mean... Look at them! You were in both? Yeah, I, I know you I know you too well. I know you too well. <gasps> oh. They're freaking cute and you can pet them. Y'all. Different vibes in the stream. Yeah, this is completely different than Bald Guy's Gate. <laughs> completely different. So we're playing Flutter Away, which is a very short game. I realized um, this is a 45 to 1 hour type game, but obviously I'm 3 hours in and we're on the final day. It's only 5 days of content. In this game, you're like camping and you're taking photos of stuff. It's an exploration game. Um, it's currently on sale, sale, for like twelve or th uh, wait, sorry, uh, eleven or twelve dollars. So it's like two dollars off than the usual. Um, and like, uh, I got it for like two dollars. So I, I spent my own real world, real world money on this. Um, but I only spent like two dollars because I had like gold points. Uh, Nintendo points saved up from some of the other games that I've played and purchased. So I only spent $2, which was well worth it because this game is freaking adorable. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? So yeah, exploration, taking photos of things. You have Cappy Barbara is her name. Relaxed and smooth is all good. It looks so relaxing. Yeah, this game has been so relaxing. Y'all have missed out on some of the campfire like crackling sounds it rained on day four um, a lot of cozy content and like you unlock things you have like a journal so you have to discover and take photos of butterflies and um, you're basically following around this like capybara and learning more about her it's so adorable love this game and then you have like little um, to do's that you got to do too Animal. Oh, we've increased our animal friendship. Okay. <gasps> Look at the little doodles. Barbara is a mama. Capybara babies are so adorable in real life. I'm in love. Barb still managed to make time for me despite having little ones to think about. I think in the end, I actually turned out to be one of her biggest babies. Oh my god. This is so cute. Ooh, and we discovered something. Oh. All, uh, so cute. Oh, and I meant to do this earlier too. Um, PME, or JB, as I've been calling him, also has a YouTube channel. He does sweet, sweet musical beats on his channel. So go check him out. Let's go subscribe. All the things. You're getting so much time out of this game. 45 minutes? Yeah, it's like 45 minutes to an hour is what I googled. Uh, and obviously it takes me so long to play a game and like when you're streaming it you're kind of interacting with like the audience and stuff too and like I'm just taking it slow didn't you say this was a quick game you've been streaming for three hours McBeal come on are you surprised are any of y'all surprised because I'm not okay can I feed I can feed a capybara like a grown one but what about the babies I don't think I can feed them. They're too little. They're too little. Oh, this is too cute. It's too cute. It's too cute. Okay. And there's a rainbow. I'll show you all the rainbow. We saw this first when we first started the day. Look at the adorable rainbow with the waterfall. I'm going to take another picture of this. Uh, let's see. Let's zoom out. Let's go a little further away. Let's do like a yeah, like a half shot. Perfect. Because all the, all the photos you take um, outside of uh, the journaling piece, you have like a bunch of photos in the front too. So here's a bunch of pictures that we've taken. Obviously, several pictures of the babies. 
Um, but we got a rainbow here. We got Cappy Barbara in front of the rainbow when we started the day. Look at that little adorable bean. Uh, look at these. Uh, and then Barbara is a model. Look at her. Look at her. We've seen tree frogs, y'all. Look at little Jeremiah from Animal Crossing New Horizons. We get little fluff butt over here. So many pictures. And you're supposed to a toucan. Toucan Sam was here earlier. Look at And then pictures of butterflies, because you're trying to capture those as well. Look at this little model. This little tree frog. I think I named him Stan. So many beautiful pictures. Where's the one? I took a picture of her um, reaching for fruit. Did I pass that already? I think I did. I think I did. Slay Barbara the model. Yes, she is a model. Straight model. Oh, wait, I used it. Um, it's one of my favorite photos. Um, I think it was day two. Or day three? Yeah, it was day three. Look at that. Look at her. Reaching for the fruit. And then this was the favorite photo of day four. Look at her. Ugh. Good evening to all. Hope all is well for everyone. It has been well. It has been well, Razmataz. Welcome in. Happy Friday. I know I welcomed you earlier. But happy Friday. I hope you're doing well as well. It's the start of the weekend. I finished um, week two of my new job. Still looking for... Oh, she followed me down here. Y'all, this game. Um, <laughs> I started... I'm still looking for other opportunities, but I finished week two at my new job. I'm in love. I'm in love with her. I, I love her. I love her. What do you call a cute door? I don't know. What do you call a cute door? Ooh, what else did we unlock? Aww. Her sleeping. I love it. A d I like that. What do you call a cute door? Adorable. I love that. She is a freaking model. Are you kidding? know what to say except for she's a model she's a model she must be protected her babies must be protected where are your babies at ma'am ma'am oh so many hidden discoveries today I love it she's a model she's an adorable animal <laughs> new job two weeks I start my new one Hope you have a great year as we all deserve. Yes, 100%. I hope everyone's having a great year. We are, what, eight months in to 2023, which is wild. The year is flying by. It'll only get faster as we as the year progresses. Oh yeah, we have to go play with uh, the hanging vine. I think it's over here. Let's go do that. And we have new um, butterflies to discover, too, I think. Here's the vine. Oh, and there's also butterflies over here. Okay. Oh, I think that's a tiger butterfly. Wait a minute. Is that a tiger butterfly? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. And here comes, here comes Barbara. Is this a tiger butterfly? Y'all. Animal Crossing has taught me a lot. 
I feel like I know that this is a tiger butterfly, specifically from Animal Crossing New Horizons. Oh. Are you kidding me? I love this. I love it so much. Okay, let's take let's take a photo. We gotta put Barbara in it. Cute. Um Oh, those are the same photo, so we'll keep the old one. Okay. Now let's see. Let's confirm. Is this a tiger butterfly? Yes or no? Let's see. A green banded day flying moth. Oh, it's a moth. I thought it was a butterfly. Oh, some butterflies mimic these moths. Such trendsetters. Look at the... It looks like it has sun, uh, sunglasses on. The caterpillars of these moths eat toxic omphalia leaves. They are so badass. I love that. So its official name is Urania lelus. Lelus. Layless or lay loose? I'm gonna say lay loose. But cute, we found um, one of them. We still need another, there's one more daytime butterfly and then a nighttime one. Um, it didn't capture us playing with this, so let's do that. Oh! <gasps> Toucan Sam! There he is! Oh! Yeah, no worries. <gasps> Look how cute he is! Are you kidding me? Y'all, uh... <laughs> Toucan Sam, please. I love this. Look at these little cute doodles. Day five is going to be our longest day, y'all. Our longest day, and I don't hate it. I don't hate it. This is so cute. I love this. Okay. Um, we did all of that. What was the last thing? Oh, photograph a yellow bromeliad. Okay, we gotta find a yellow flower. Um, I don't think I've seen... Oh yeah, they're, they're on the, um, the other path. Let's go find it. Take a photo. And then y'all will get to see... Oh my god, these babies... Y'all will get to see the campsite at nighttime, which is so cute and very, uh, very aesthetic, may I say. Okay, let's take a photo of this. Perfect. What's the name of the game? It is called Flutter Away, and it is available on Switch and um, Steam as well, so like PC. It's pro it probably looks way better on Steam, but... Oh, we have to find another butterfly. On Switch? I mean, it looks pretty dang good. Let me, um, let me show you another example of the butterflies up close. Like, look at this. It's kind of pretty decent on Switch. Like, look at the detail here. It's pretty good. If I paid full price for this, honestly, with how long I've been playing it, all the cuteness factors, and just like the details and how it's been running, I would I would not be upset with uh, the price tag because it's not like a forty dollar game. It's like it's not even fifteen. It's like twelve or thirteen dollars. Okay, we're gonna find our last butterfly in the daytime. I keep hearing what I think is a capybara, but I don't see little Barbara. But we do need to take a photo of these guys. So let's do that. Perfect. And then let's do our little perch. And take a closer look. Ooh, that's so pretty. Look at that, y'all. So pretty. 
gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous girls play Flutter Away. Yeah, it's. I think this would also be super good on um, if you played it with headphones on. It did say, like, it suggests playing it with the sound on, obviously, because of all the, like, ambiance and, like, the sounds and things. I definitely will probably play this game again all the way through with headphones on because it's been, it's been so relaxing. All right, let's learn about the final butterfly during the day. The Sunset Morpho. Morpho Hikuba. If blue morphos are forest spirits, sunset morphos must be the gods. They're huge. Look at this. Do it all. They're so cute. Such a gentle, quiet species. The perfect metaphor for a sunset. Sort of like a sunset moth. Look at... Truly cannot beat some of these photos. Truly cannot. Look at this. Oh, I love it. The sunset. Yes, it's so pretty. All right, let's find our nighttime moth. <gasps> the toucan's on the table. Toucan Sam's on the table. Wait a minute, Toucan Sam is on the table. I must take a picture of him with the babies and everything. I'm gonna keep the old photo because I like that, but I love this photo I just took. Okay, let's take a closer look at Toucan Sam. Another model, y'all. Look at this. I love it. I love it. I truly love it. All right. Oh my god. Wait, can I pet? Oh my gosh, if I could pet the toucan. That would be amazing, but I cannot. I cannot. But I can pet Mama here. What shall I call the babies? Ooh, that's a good question. What should their names be? Any suggestions? We got Cappy Barbara. But what should the two babies be named? Let's see if I can get them in a cute little like family photo here. Sure, we'll put the little we'll put the little toucan at the back too. All right, what should their names be? Kara, that's cute. Hmm. Kara, they should be both C names. Kara and Kobe, maybe. Kara and Kobe. I like that. Got Cappy Barbara and Kara and Kobe. <gasps> That's cute. Okay, I'm in love. I'm in love. Kara and Cappy. That's cute too. All right, we need to find the. Isn't there a? Yeah, there's a nighttime butterfly we gotta find. So let's explore. I think we came from that direction. So let's go. Let's go down this way, maybe. Let's see. Where are the sun rays? Or the rays. I guess it's not really in the sun. Um, there's supposed to be a nighttime one. Oh, maybe I need to. Okay. I forget. If I sit down, it'll turn nighttime. So let's make sure we get all the pictures we want. Where are you going? 
all the pictures we want because I'm about to start the fire. And it shall be nighttime. Or it shall be very soon. The sun will go down. It's getting darker. Ugh. Oh, she's coming back. Make sure you take care of your babies. Look at them. What's mama doing? Where's she going? I'm gonna make me babysit. Okay. Fluff butt, where are you going? Oh, she's showing me the the butterfly I need to go find. <gasps> it's huge. Where'd you go? Hello? Oh. Found it. Wow, so pretty. <gasps> Look at how white it is. Can you open again? It's so pretty though. Wow, so blue and then white. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's gorgeous. Okay, let's take a photo of it. Let's zoom in on it. Perfect. So pretty. A witch, uh, a white witch moth. Okay, let's read about it. We only have two more to do's and then we're done, y'all. Okay, the white witch moth. Okay, my mouth is dry. Let me drink some water. Oh, that's interesting. It says, um, the white witch moth. I listened to a podcast recently that said no one knows what the caterpillar or cocoon of this species look like. Interesting. Okay. Speaking of podcasts, if you enjoy seeing my face and if you want to see more of my face, um, you should go subscribe to Carpool Gaming, where I'm also one of the co-hosts of the Nintendo Drive. We talk sometimes Nintendo related stuff and sometimes we just talk about random stuff like what games we're playing like random life stuff as well we have a patreon all of those things but for free if you want something for free more content go subscribe to Carpool Gaming where you can see me every Tuesday evening with my other two co-hosts and where we talk about Nintendo and just gaming in general and random stuff too uh, let's see. Early naturalists mistook these for birds and tried shooting them down with guns to get close to them. What? Why would you do that? Nightbot is like, I got you. <laughs> got you, fam. And then the other thing too. Oh, it's already in the. It's already in the chat, but I'll add it again. Um, if you want to follow me on any of my socials, uh, the link will pop up here in a second. And then, you know, subscribe. If you want to uh, catch any of my new future live streams or any of my future YouTube edited content, you know, subscribe to the Chanel. All right, so I'm going to make my best attempt at the last formal naming of this butterfly or moth. Um, Tysania. Agrippina. That is my best effort to pronounce that. <laughs> Very pretty though. Very pretty. This toucan is... What's mama doing? What are you doing, mama? What you doing? 
What you doing? You're so cute. I can't. I can't. You're adorbs. I can't. Let's turn this on so I can see her better. Miss Model here. Ah! Uh, Y'all! I cannot. Cannot. taking all the screenshots. I don't want this game to end, y'all. <laughs> the live streams are like 1am to start, like past my bedtime. I'm so sorry, Kylie. <laughs> Sometimes I'll stream on Saturdays or Sundays during the day, um, but Thursday slash Friday nights are always at 8pm my time, unfortunately. <laughs> sorry, but I appreciate you being here. I appreciate you so much. All right, let's see. What are our final things we need to do? Um, photograph the stars and then sit down one last time. So once we sit down, we are done, y'all. But let's photograph the stars. So pretty. Let's go down here this time and photograph them. Got the waterfall over here. You can't see it, but there is a waterfall in the background here. Oh, the wonderful sounds. Let's zoom out. Let's do, yeah, like right here maybe. Get, a, get some leafage in there. Beautiful, beautiful. No, I don't want it to end. Unfortunately, sometimes things need to end. Unfortunately. But this has been so much fun. I don't want it to end either, but this game has been a lot of fun. I've been streaming for almost three and a half hours, which is, I guess, within range of my normal. I just want to take all the photos of Barbara, though, too. Like, she's so cute. Look at her. Freaking adorable. I love her. I love her so much. Okay, before I sit down in the chair, y'all. I'm going to switch over to this. Okay, let me move. Um, let's do that. So you can see the babies. You can see Toucan Sam. <laughs> uh, we're going to see the last little bit, but let's... Let's just sit here. I'm going to mute my mic. I'm going to turn up the sounds and we're going to enjoy the fire for a second. And then we will end the video or the stream, I guess. But I'm going to mute my mic and I'm going to turn up the sounds and we're just going to sit here for a second and just enjoy the sounds and then we'll enjoy the last little bit. And look at Barbara's coming here to hang out with us. Perfect timing. So let's enjoy the sounds here, y'all. <laughs> Thank you. 
Alright, y'all. Switching back to this. We're gonna do our final sit down in the chair, but I hope y'all enjoyed that little bit. But we've gotta take a picture of mama and babies here. Look at that. Oh, freaking cute. Look at her. So cute. I love it. I love it so much. So adorbs. Okay. One more photo of them. Little family photo. All right, let's do our last little sit down. One last time, enjoy. My dog is drinking water, of course. I was surprised. Oh, where are you going? One last little pet on mama here. One last little pet on the babies. They're so cute. The little sounds. y'all oh man i'm gonna play this tomorrow i think this is cute seth it's pretty dang cute welcome in it's pretty dang cute y'all pretty dang cute let me show you how cute it is look at all the photos look at all the photos mama and babies the mama is happy barbara Come on. It's freaking cute. This game, okay, Seth, this game is supposed to be like 45 minutes to an hour. But like, clearly I've gone over. We got set a code this morning. I haven't had a chance to play it. Seth, play it, play it. Cappy Barbara, yes, is her name. That's what they called her in the game. And then we got, I called this guy, obviously, Toucan Sam. I mean, come on. Look at these pictures that I've taken. I can't stop. Look at them. Look at the rainbow. Wait a minute. Her, Happy Barbara, enjoying the rainbow. Her hanging out in the campsite with me. If you got a code, you better play this dang game. There's a there's tree frogs. So so it's supposed to be pretty short and sweet. Yeah, it's supposed to be. But I have obviously lengthened this game by like a lot. <laughs> there's like 5 days in total. You play daytime and nighttime of each day and you have to find different like um, different species of butterflies and you have like to-dos before the day ends all those types of things and then little animal friendship stuff you know don't want to spoil it but the little doodles in the journal are cute the little hidden discoveries it's it's cute I don't hate it and it's very relaxing yes I think if you do play it you should um, Play it with headphones on but if you're gonna play it for like a video maybe still play with headphones on i think i could see myself playing this again all the way through specifically with headphones on and then this is the star of the show right here mama right here star of the show look at her freaking adorbs happy barbara right there i mean star of the show Look at her. 
She even knows it. Look at her. I fluffed around and found out that this is the most adorable game in the world. <laughs> and I hate to go to sleep, but we have reached the end. We've reached the end. Um, again, this is Cozy K. She was one of the hosts on Wholesome Games. I didn't even know she was in the game, but that's her right there. And I'm not sure who this person is. Um, so I'm very curious to know who that could be. I'm not sure. But we've got Cozy K here. She's a YouTuber. Just search Cozy K. All one word. And you'll find her. She has like 116,000 subs, I think is what we found out at the start of the stream. And then I'm not sure who this is. But they have pictures of themselves in the, in the game. But yeah, it's wanting me to end the last day, unfortunately. We got Toucan Sam over here. We got Cappy Barbara's babies, which we have named Kara and Cappy. They don't have names. We named them that. And then Cappy Barbara over here. For the final time, we shall say goodnight to them. And we will end off the stream, y'all. Let's go to sleep for the final time. And we're going to pick our favorite photo for the day, too, I think is the last thing. All right, our night log. The sun has set, the fireflies are twinkling, and my butterfly friends danced around me as I made my way back to my tent for the last evening. The bittersweetness is odd. I am so sad to leave this enchanting place, but can't wait to get back home and share my adventure with my partner. I have so many great photos to show off. We really do. Maybe it's supposed to be a... Oh, yeah. Maybe Gab Smolders. Maybe it's one of uh, the other hosts. I could see that being her. Alright, we're going to pick our favorite photo of the day for the last time, y'all. This is hard. Favorite photo? Look at... Mama and Babies? Toucan Sam on the table. Mama on her own. I feel like we have to have the babies. We have to have the babies, right? But look at the sunset. All of them together. Should we include Toucan or no? Should we... I want to put the babies as the favorite. Ain't no way it's not the family photo. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Ugh. The rainbow, though. Her in front of the rainbow. I think you're right, though. I think it has to be a close-up of the family. This sunset is so pretty, too. So many great photos. But I feel like it's got to be the family photo. All right, let's do one more poll. We're going to pick between the three family photos we have. We've got number one. We've got kind of a, a little bit of Toucan Sam in the back here. Her stretching up. Big stretch. We've got this one where she kind of looks a little sleepy. So we got number one, stretching. Number two, a little sleepy. And number three, a close-up of all of them. Um, I will add all the options here. Y'all vote in the poll and we will pick. One. One. Two. Or three. Oh, or three. Y'all vote. And I will pick the final family photo. Final favorite photo, I guess. We're making it the family photo. But fi final favorite photo of the evening. Again, one. The little, little outstretched neck. Two. She's looking a little sleepy, but the babies are just chilling. Or three. They are all resting. You guys sleep pick two? Oh no. Oh no. Well, three is winning. This is the winner so far. So far, number three. 
is the fave. This is this one's kind of cute too. The stretching. And we got a little toucan Sam in the back. You wanted three, but you accidentally picked two. I think um I think three is the winner, y'all. I think three is the winner. Place your place your votes. I was gonna say place your bets, but there's no bet betting going on. Um, place your votes. We got one, two, or three. One, two, or three. Three, two, one. Ending the poll. Clearly, number three, one. So this is gonna be the favorite photo of the day. They're all cute either way. That's very true, JB. Very true. Um, but this is the winner. The final favorite photo for the game. Oh, look at that. I love that it adds it to the journal. So cute. I hate to exit. We completed 86% of the game. Okay, so I bet there's more hidden... Um, hidden, like, discoveries then. Interesting. Y'all, this was fun. We finished, we started and finished a game all in one session, all in one stream. That's wild. That is wild. So we're going to enjoy the little credits here. Oh my goodness. Look at that. I need to figure out what all the, like, hidden discoveries are because I want to find it all. I want to catch them all. I want to find them all. I want to find everything. But there's a, there's the credits of people that created, designed, did the art. I want to know who did the doodles. Does is it gonna say, animator, UI? It's probably one of those people. Cause I like the little like doodles in the journal. Oh, I just realized. Is it including? Yeah, it's including my photos that I took, I'm pretty sure. It's just kind of, it flipped them. Interesting. The 2D artist? Oh, okay. Yeah, the, the little doodles in the journal. Oh, achievements! Can I read the achievements? <gasps> we got achievements, y'all. We missed one, two, three. We missed four achievements. Okay, we got... We took 50 plus photos. We took 100 plus photos. This is... I'm not sure what that one is. It looks like stars, though. Um, budding botanist. Took 10 plus photos of flowers. <laughs> Shook trees 10 times. Sat on the chair for three minutes at one time. We did a few of those. This one, it doesn't say. Took 300 steps. This one doesn't say t either, but I feel like it has to do with the butterflies, has to do with capybara, and I bet this one is after we've gotten all the others. So if we've gotten these three, we would have gotten all four. <gasps> I want to know what we missed. <laughs> I want to know what we missed. We took, I took two photos of the stars, so it makes me wonder if, if I would have taken several, maybe, maybe five? I don't know. I'm not sure. I'll have to look it up. I'll see if that's out there somewhere. So the next time I play it, I, next time I play it, it's going to be on my own with headphones on. But I want to get the rest of these achievements. I don't hate it. I love it. Alrighty, y'all. I'm going to end the stream off right here. But we started and finished Flutter Away. Which I only spent $2. Again, I only spent $2 on the game. But it is currently on sale for like, what did we say? 10 and change right now. I'm pretty sure. Let me let me look it up. Let me look it up. Um, let's see. A 
let's see, flutter home, flutter, oh wait, flutter away, not flutter home. Um, okay, so it's currently 16% off in the eShop. Originally $12.99 USD, it is now $10.91 USD. Um, but I had a bunch of Nintendo gold points so I was able to, I only had to spend like two bucks, I think, for it. Because um, I bought it in another game at the same time. So, for me, it was completely worth it. You, you know, decipher it for, your, for yourself if you want to play or spend um, 1091. It is on sale for the next, two, three, like five or six days. Um, it is on sale currently, so yeah, August 24th, it will no longer be on sale, so if you want to catch it while it's on sale, do so. I was able to lengthen the time, the gameplay, through three and a half hours, but supposedly it only takes 45 minutes to like an hour to play the game. What you got there, Ribo? Yeah, you could spend a good chunk of time with it if you take it at your own pace. I think if you wore headphones and played it, I think it would be even more interesting and a lot more immersive as well. Especially the times where we're sitting at the campfire and just listening to like the camp, like the fire like crackling. Like those were really good moments. And like you can take, I don't know how many photos. Clearly I took over a hundred because <laughs> I got the achievement. So, yeah, I don't know how many photos you can take, but at least over a hundred. Oh yeah, be headphoned up on a Saturday, for sure. <laughs> Y'all, I took my time and I only finished, or I only, um, achieved 86% of the game. Like, imagine if you knew, like, all the things, all the secrets. I want to look it up. I want to get 100%, y'all. I'll take a screenshot if I do reach 100% and then I'll share it. But hey, I beat a game in August. I, I have not beat a game in, in July. I've been trying to beat one, one game a month, but I did not beat a game in July. But I beat one in August, so if I beat two in August, I should be covered. <laughs> I do seem relaxed. Well, it's because I've had one of these. Two of these. Oh yeah, and then the petting of the capybaras too, or Capy Barbara and babies. But I appreciate y'all for hanging out for this lovely chill Friday night stream. Um, we fluffed around and found out that Flutter Away is totes adorable, or totes adorbs. And I'll probably play through it again on my off time uh, with headphones on, probably. You pet a real capybara a couple of months ago named Coconut? Okay, now I'm just jealous. Oh, July's your birthday? That's wild. Happy belated birthday, by the way. Congrats. Thanks, Star. Um, but thank you all for hanging out for tonight's stream. What else? I might stream Saturday or Sunday during the day this weekend. I'm not entirely sure yet. I kind of want to play some more Fall of Porcupine. Um, so if I do, it'll be during the day on Saturday or Sunday, but we'll see. I know, Co Coconut's an adorable name. An interactive zoo in Houston. Okay, now I have to go. <laughs> Houston is like several hours away from me. <laughs> Texas is a big state. Um, so I might fall, play uh, Fall of Porcupine on Saturday or Sunday. We shall see. It'll be during the day, of course. Um, but if I don't see you this weekend, I'll see y'all next week, Thursday night, probably, for the regular 
uh, for, for the regular nightly streams or weekly streams. And I'm not sure what video I'm going to put out next week. I am working on something, but it all depends on if I finish it uh, or finish the part that I'm working on and then edit it in time. Um, otherwise, I would give you a little, little behind the scenes sneak peek as to what, uh, what that Thursday video will be next week. It's like the midway point between you and I. Oh yeah, I forget that is. I forget that it's like the midway point. Oh my goodness. Well, clearly I'm yawning. Clearly I need to head to the bed. Um, but I will see y'all either this weekend or Thursday night. But I'll leave y'all to listen to the sultry sounds of the game um, in the ending soon screen. But uh, if you don't already follow me on my socials, here's a link to my website, my card. That has all of my socials on there if you want to follow me obviously subscribe if you want to be notified of future streams or content and yeah i will see y'all this weekend or next week y'all be good have a lovely rest of your friday and a good weekend bye y'all i'm out skis Thank you.